Hey everyone, how's it going? As you can tell, we have a couple new emotes in chat. Uh, we also have sub badges, and I don't know if they're permanent. Uh, I just wanted to give you guys something, so we took one of the new emotes and just put different colored shirts on them. I don't know if that's going to be the forever sub badge, but it's uh, what we have right now. And they do look sick, says Toasty, aka the artist who made them. <coughs> Personally, I really like the Alpha at W, uh, if everyone wants to spam that one, because it was made on accident. It's actually just the same emote as, as the Hey, but it's I zoomed in on accident when making the emote, and I go, wait, that's pretty funny. <laughs> So, uh, it just, it just, I just kept it on accident. Yeah, we have a new raid emote suddenly. It almost makes me just want to change my profile picture to it. I'm not going to lie. Maybe that's the 3 million arc. I've, I've kind of changed, uh, my profile picture on milestones, so. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. I... Yeah, it's too late. It's our, the other one's already into Mega Strikers. I'll think about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm considering. I like a high Joe emote. Awesome. Thank you. So, also, let's talk about it. Um, hi, guys. How's it going? Uh, oh, wait. I am missing something. Something crucial to my... To my uh, I could not see the subs that were coming, and we're already at level 5 hype train. That makes sense. Um, yeah. So, today's stream is going to start off like all others with a shill. Um, I, look, okay. I, I want to explain my goal. So, I've talked about it. We are trying to hit 10,000 subs. We're currently at 7,500, which is a lot. But once you hit 10,000, you get the maximum amount of emotes any streamer can have. So, I want to try, just everyone check to see if you have a prime. Just, just please, because I just want to hit this number once, and then we never have to hit it again. It's literally just a one-time thing. And I've done the math. We have roughly eight days to hit it before Sub Decay starts making things a lot harder. Because the number was like 8,200, and then it's gone down over the past few days, because this time, 30 days ago, someone subbed, and 30 days pass, and then their sub is gone. So, it's like... I think if we're going to do it, we have eight days to strike before it becomes a lot harder. And that is my analysis on it. It's like, I'm not trying to get you to sub through mind game tactics. It's through pity, desperation, and a bit of just opportunism. Is that a word? I'm being opportunistic. That's the one I was looking for. Yeah, cringe sub decay. Oh, wait. Jacob, me and my friends are stri grinding strikers for your team. Hell yeah. That's what we, Oh my god, Jaden, thank you for the 20 gifted. Alright, thank you, Jaden. Thank you for the cause. <coughs> We're getting there. <coughs> Slowly but surely. Um, yeah. So, uh, wow, thank you. Yeah. Um, and you get your little emote now. Yeah. Do I hit the RNG check? Uh, someone will gift a sub and you will get one. That is just how it works. Um, we, today... So normally everything turns into a video, right? Um, I'm streaming kind of late today. That doesn't really matter. But uh, I'm streaming way later than I normally do. But I'm doing... I don't really care if today turns into a video. I just kind of want to do some stuff for fun. Um, while shilling, of course. Uh, we're going to do the Shiny Let's Go stream. Which, like... It's like, yeah, these streams turn into a video. But today's whole stream will probably be, like, one sentence long in the total video. If even mentioned at all, you know? So... I want to try to, I want to play until we get one shiny Pokemon, and then I want to maybe do another Mario Party four-player controller speed run, or if not that, maybe play Omega Strikers. Uh, I'm open to either. I, I don't really know what I would do, but also, wait, 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 I actually have something huge to show. Um, Mario, like Mario Party Stars. So, you guys remember how, uh, let me, let me find the other day, we ran, we did Mario Party speedruns, but it was, there was a catch. I controlled all four characters, and it was, it was a run called a uh, four player, one controller. One controller, four, one player, four controllers. 
And uh, if you look right here, uh, here, wait, here is me doing it. You know, I have all, it's a speed run where you have to get through with, you have one person controlling all four people. You try to get through as fast as you can. Um, 206, right? And I was saying like sub two hour is possible. Well, chat, you want to know something really funny? You want to know something really funny? I forgot that we already did this and got a 158. <laughs> I knew we did it, but I didn't realize we did all boards. I forgot. I forgot I got did it literally four months ago in December. So, uh, sub two hour is possible. And then upon realizing this, I sent a request to the mods if they could actually add 1P4C to the leaderboards. And, uh... If you look right here, uh, just like Super, they have added 1P4C to the leaderboards. And someone just has world record! Three runs, but hey man, a win's a win's a win. No, we did get world record, baby. Not last stream, but now I kind of want to try to take this time lower. Because I'm already optimizing it in my head. Someone can snipe it. I don't care. I I was a world record holder from Mario Party at one point in time. And that's all I need. Oh my god. Thank you, Geo, for the five gifted. Thank you, Rain, for the five gifted. Thank you, Collodian, for the gifted. Oh my god. We're going to do predictions with the four-player run? I'm down. Of course, if we do it. But uh, right now, I want to start the stream off. Because, like, I'm trying to figure out the best ways to do, like, the shiny Nuzlocke. And I think I'm just going to start by doing, like open stream, catch a shiny Pokemon, and then do something else. Because then I think it makes it feel like less of like a like a drag. You know, if I have to spend like 12 hour days in a row doing shiny Pokemon. So I think that's kind of what I'm going to do for like the foreseeable future. <clears throat> oh, and also, I, I learned this the other day. Um, they have uh, modifiers for emotes. So if you have, if you like those little, the tiny little alpha red heads you have by your sub names, um, if you're a tier two sub, they get cat ears. And if you're a tier three, they get a crown. But <laughs> I, I just want everyone to know that if there are any tier two or three in the subs, that, that is true. You can also do that. You can do that. But yeah, I just want everyone to know that. Yeah, the tier two is incoming. Thank you for letting you draw. Yeah, of course, Tosi. Whoa, look at that. Suddenly we have a tier two sub. What changes the shirt color? Uh, being subbed longer. Uh, I think it's one month, three months, six, nine, 12, 18, 24, 36, maybe 30, 36. I don't, I don't remember. Just, it's like, just over time. You get it. Did Jaden make the emotes? No. It, Toasty did. There are more artists in the world than Jaden animations. I, I regret to inform you. Uh, it's <laughs> yeah, Toasty made those emotes. <clears throat> I could immediately tell it was Toasty's work. Yeah. Me when Jaden draws everything. <laughs> Jaden, if you drew everything in the world, I mean, there's no really punch by what. You'd be tired if you exhausted. Yeah, it's... Also, I haven't shown off this shirt. I like the little Dragon Knight shirt. Show Whimsicott. Uh, I have two Whimsicotts hiding behind chat. Wait, where's the other Whimsicott? Here it is. There we go. Ah, now they're both there. And then I have all my others. I There's two shelves up there you guys can't really see. But, uh, music's a little loud. Well, I think it's mainly because I was over there, and that's why you couldn't really hear me. And the music does look a little loud, though. I'll turn it down just a, just a tad. <sighs> so, yeah, I think... Chat, what do we feel? Like, I kind of want to play Omega Strikers. I know I was sponsored, but I just genuinely like the game. Oh, my God, Striped. Oh, my God, five gifted back-to-back. Uh, thank you, Yacha. Thank you for Striped Swallowtail. Oh. 
I just had wings before, uh, like seconds before I turned on stream. And uh, chat, where do you fall on boneless wings being big chicken nuggets? Because uh, I'm a huge boneless wings fan, but I agree that they are just big chicken nuggets. I don't know why people are, are so offended by that, but I think that's just the truth. I think they're big nuggets. Yeah. No, they're good, but they're still just big nuggets, you know? Some people say, oh, that's different because you put sauce on them. Chicken nuggets, you dip in sauce. And, and I get that. But, like, what's stopping me from putting sauce on a ch smaller chicken nugget? You know? I, 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 I just don't... I think it's just the same thing. They might be presented a little differently, but I think they're the same thing. Yeah, it just it feels like opium. I agree. No, I absolutely agree. Now I want nuggets. Yeah. Um, thank you to Long God for the five gifted. Oh my god, you just booted up straight. That's how it's stream's been lately. I mean, I did tough through Super Mario Pinball, and we beat the game, right, chat? Right? We beat the game? Dude, that was, uh... Did anybody who watched this stream go and play Super Mario Pinball after that stream? Because I gotta know how that went. Oh my god, thank you, Shattered Code, for the five gift. Oh my... Thank you. Holy shit. I said uh, little little sub goals. When we hit 8.5k, I would uh, watch my first Let's Play I ever recorded. It's not on YouTube. Let me make sure I can find it real quick, just so... I know where to where to go for. Um, huh. I know I know it's around. Um, I, I'm searching through my Google Drive right now. I'm sure I can find this. Oh, oh. Oh wait, I don't want to show the link. Hold up. Um, wait, I, I can just do this. Chat, look at this. I found it. All seven episodes right here. Oh, baby. No, it's here. No, 100%. We have it. That is uh, my, my first Let's Play. Uh, I'm just going to... Can I just download it all right now so I don't have to watch it uh, in Google Drive? Tell me about this shiny Charizard. Uh, we just caught a shiny Charizard. That's that's really it. But now we have to catch uh, 50 more. Uh, I look away and we've already hit another high train. Jesus Christ. Thank you, everybody. Uh, you saw my tweet uh, the other day, perhaps. Um, I'm bad with time. It was probably just yesterday. <laughs> yeah, it was yesterday. Uh, what a batshit crazy month it's been. Um, I just talked about it. Uh, we hit on the channel. Obviously, hitting 3 million was a pretty big deal. And uh, we're about to hit 3.1 million. Like, just look at this subgraph. <laughs> I, I think this says everything you need to know, right? Th this is crazy. Like, I thought November, December were good months for the record. November, December were good months for me. But look, we got like 45, 43k subs. Like, that sounded pretty good. And December, November, December were good months. And then, uh, then subs. Uh, YouTube Shorts is one hell of a drug as the main takeaway from here. But also the Egglock gave us like 30k subs. Like that one video did it. It was, uh, yeah, 92.6k more. It's, uh, it's just a little bit. It's Shorts. It is Shorts. But it's still like, even if the answer was entirely YouTube Shorts, what the fuck? You know? Like that's crazy. That's still crazy. Um, and yeah, I just had like, I think the average viewers on Twitch are higher. We hit 8,000 subs. We're still working back to it because of sub decay, but, uh, YouTube's been crazy. I think YouTube's so crazy, but I want to try and find ways to, uh, hype up my Twitch more. I think that's like the next big play because I think the egg lock was a great way to get people to come over and just like check it out. Right. Um, I think that was great. I just want to find more ways where I can just kind of like make you feel more part of the content. What is CCV? Uh, it's concurrent viewer. So uh, like right now we have 20, uh, 2.1K CCV. 
It, it just means viewer count, but it's just like, you know, viewer could be like total viewer count, or it, it could be a lot. Run like a contest? Contests are kind of lame. <laughs> no, I, I don't really, I really want to do that. Um, I, I don't want it to do like, you are the, I don't want it to be where the viewer is the content, but I want it to be part of the content. I think consistent frequency is what I look for in streamers. That's cool, but I, I, I think what a lot of, like, what a lot of non-stream watchers, like, Necroke, like, I see you everywhere. Like, you're in everyone's stream. Um, I'm trying to pull the people over from YouTube who probably don't watch a lot of streams. Like, that's the target demo I need to figure out. How do I get them over here? Like, I think the Egglock is a prime example. They came over because they want to be part of it. And then when I actually stream the community Egglock, people are going to be coming over to see if they're in it, you know? Maybe Texas speech could be a good idea? Texas speech is never a good idea. Look, I think you're missing the point. I don't want you to feel like you are the content. I don't like Texas speech. It's not what I what, what I like. I like, uh, first off, I don't trust you guys. Second, it's just, I want to do ideas that allows you guys to be part of it, but it's still me at the end of the day. I think that's how it is. Again, Egglog is a perfect example. A bit different from Doug Doug, huh? Well, I would say it's different from a lot of people. <laughs> Not just Doug Doug. <laughs> um, ooh, Jackbox is always fun. I don't think I don't think we get the idea. Um, okay, so the crux of my channel is not I do this game. Like, it's not me playing Jackbox, you know? It's me taking this game, putting an arbitrary rule on it, and then go from there. So, Jackbox isn't really that interesting because to make a video out of Jackbox would just be highlights, you know? There's no narrative. It's like, Jackbox, but you can't say come, you know? <laughs> Impossible. Yeah, it's, it's just, how do you take this idea, put a twist on it that makes it fun, but your personality can still carry it? Yeah, that'd be impossible. Yeah. Are you going to make a video on my bracket from Ultimate Summit 5? I don't remember what I did, so probably not. <laughs> oh, the Smashdown bracket? Yeah, probably not. It wasn't that interesting. What about some games with crowd control? I do want to do crowd control, but that's not entirely what I mean. But I do want to do crowd control, and I probably will do it soon. It's on my list, you know, on top of being a world record holder. <clears throat> All right, hello Miku. Let's play some Pokemon. Oh, do a subathon? I plan on it. I, I do plan on it. Jackbox is a killer shorts farm. Oh, I didn't even think about that, but you're probably right. Jackbox could be really good for shorts. Um, but uh, I, I mean, our videos. Honestly, I'm pretty like ahead of schedule for videos. We kind of have like the next month or and a half planned for videos, which is nice. Um, but it's just a matter of like getting new ideas that uh, I do want to do a subathon and that's going to be a whole process. And holy shit, dude. I'm like already drafting like what I want the stretch goals of the subathon to be. And I, I have one. Okay, I have one chat. I, okay, okay. This one. It's, it's going to excite a lot of people. If this... I haven't told you guys when the subathon is, of course. It's going to be a fun surprise. But I do have one rule thing in mind. If, and I say if, the subathon goes to the entire length, um, like all 31 days, if that happens to happen, let me show you what I have planned. I have... I need to check the logistics of this because I need to see how I'm going to go about it. What the fuck? Why can't I find it? Oh, I know what I was looking for. Um... All right, chat. If the subathon goes all the way, I will raffle off my most prized possession 
to one of you. If we go the full 31 days. Yes. No, I mean it. No, I mean it. Yes. I will personally drive it out to you if you happen to win. So, just know the sub do, are the plushes included? No. No, the plushes are not included. They are Jaden's and when I asked her if she was okay with this idea, she said the plushes are not included. So, it's just the car. Is it paid for? Yes, it is paid for. What if international viewers? I unfortunately Meek car will be limited to uh Anything I can drive through, drive to. If you are on the upper insane part of Canada, that counts. I'll drive it to you. If you are in Hawaii, even if you're in the US, I'm not driving it to you. If you're, someone said, what if I'm in Georgia? What, what the fuck you mean? Yeah, yeah, I'll drive it to Georgia. Let's, yeah. Does Sweden count? Yes, yeah, Sweden is a, uh, not continental to the US. That is that is correct. Yeah. So, uh, what if I'm in SoCal? Dude, if you're in SoCal, I'm rigging the ballot. That shit's easy. Yeah, I'll just drive it down the street for you. That's easy, perfect, even. Um, so Alaska counts? Oh shit, does Alaska count? Oh, I guess Alaska counts. It's not the easiest thing to do, but I guess Alaska counts, huh? But yeah, so uh, the subathon is going to be big because you will have a chance to win Miku Car. Uh, I mainly needed Miku Car for the bit, and now uh, the bit has served its course, and it is just uh, blocking my garage. Yo, CJ, hey, Alfred, big fan. CJ, I was just saying, uh, if my subathon later this year goes to all 31 days, I'm raffling off Miku Car. CJ, maybe even you could get it. South American viewers thriving? Oh, fuck. I guess you're right. I can drive to South America, can't I? Okay, yeah. Well, that's, uh... All South American countries count, then. Yeah, no, we'll go to Argentina if we need to. I'm digging my own grave. Argentina, yeah. Um... What if no driver's license? So I think it's fair to put an age limit on the car, right? I haven't decided on what yet. I don't want to give it to a 16-year-old. I've decided that. Maybe an 18-year-old. Definitely a 21-year-old. So it's I 18. I think it's I. The cutoff is either going to be 18 or 21. I haven't decided which yet. Yeah, we're almost second place in the strikers. Wait, did we drop? We were in second place. Oh no, what happened? We were. Someone said a 16, 17 plus? No, no, it's, it is, I know you're probably 17, which is why you're asking, but no, it's gonna be 18 plus at minimum. Um, okay, so I'm looking at it. So Team Shaka and us, we are going back and forth, and I think it's because I've heard they're one of the biggest streamers in Japan, so I think it's just the time zones keep flipping, so we keep going back and forth in second to third place, because I, I think when my viewers were asleep, theirs were up. So uh, I think we just keep going back and forth, but from what I've heard is that second and third place gets the exact same rewards. So I'm fine going flip-flop between second or third, uh, I have given up on first. We are given up on first. Join forces to beat Ludwig. Dude, only if it was that easy, I would. Maybe I should just reach out to them and be like, talk to Omega Strike and be like, hey, can we join forces? Can we, uh, can we? Because if you add up our numbers together, we beat Ludwig and Charlie, you know? So it's possible. Yeah. Yeah, I'll reach out to them. That would go crazy. 
Sea Dog was pointing to team up. Yeah, I talked to Sea Dog too. I think all three of us should team up. No, that'd be great. Um, yeah, I think by the end of the day we'll probably be back in second just because of time zones. But uh, I'm happy with second. We were in second when I checked last night. So again, if anyone has a Mega Strikers, uh, we're in this Creator versus event, and if we finish the event in second or third place. Uh, we get revenue share of the game, which I don't even really care about. The, I talked to the CEO last night, and I was like, dude, creators who have a big enough audience to uh, get first, second, third, do not give a fuck about having more money. <laughs> so, oh, and it just went up. Yeah, no, no we're fine. Um, we just have to make sure we don't drop to fourth, because I think Sea Dog could sneak up on us, uh, but there's you can't see because of my head, but there's five days left in the event. So we just have to stay cool for five days. I'm always going to be checking up on it. Uh, if we win, we get a free skin in the game, which is pretty goddamn cool. I think that's pretty awesome. Um, I don't know who I would put the skin on, because um, I really I think Ruin's my favorite character, but uh, Juno is also really fun. But I I don't know. I don't know what I want to do yet. I know that if Moist Moguls win, they're putting all money towards their team. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, that's cool. But, um... Yeah. So, I don't really care about the revenue share. I just want to, uh... Put... I think, like, Estelle is kind of the character I like the most. Uh, visually. Rune is kind of the character I like playing the most. Probably him and Juno. I think I kind of want to... I'd want to do, like, a Starry Night thing. And, uh probably make it i don't want to make it look like an alpha rat skin but i want to maybe give it like a little uh like a chain at the bottom that just has a little logo on it maybe something very small and subtle but um yeah anyways that was a long intro much longer than normal yeah stream hasn't even started yet yeah my bad you just want to get into the i mean i guess like the fun part about shiny hunting is that we can just continue this conversation. <laughs> you know? None of this conversation matters. Um... Oh, no. Oh, no. We just started a trainer battle. Okay. Yeah, hop on a Mega Strikers. If you are just watching this stream and have nothing to do, I urge you to download a Mega Strikers today and join Team Alpha Rad and just try to get us as many wins as you can. Uh, do quick play run... Okay, do quick play wins count the same as normal matches? Because then I think we should all be doing quick play matches, you know? I think we should all just farm the quick play matches. Is it free? It is free. And it's a mobile game. But what if I'm bad? Okay, so if you're bad, join team... Mo <laughs> I wish losing deducted points. Now that'd be badass. <laughs> no, uh... If you're bad, join our team. Who knows? You might get carried and win. Uh, okay, so I'm going to get off the Charizard. Return to Pokeball. Yeah, because now I think we want to... Uh... Or do we want to do Caterpie? Is that the vibe we're feeling today? It only counts if you score the goals. Oh, it's goals scored. I thought it was games won. Oh, okay. Okay. Hear me out. So if you are on... I think we just do Caterpie, right? Is Caterpie time? Do Ekans? I don't know if we need Ekans. So here's my plan. If you are on a team... Let's say you are Team Alpharad. And you see... No, actually, I don't want to propose throwing because I feel like I could say something as a joke and then it gets clipped out of context on Twitter and then it becomes a really controversial thing. That, that's kind of how I feel. So I'm actually not going to propose that. Um, but yeah, let's uh, let's do Caterpie. Let's, oh my god, so many Pidgeys from last stream. And I get flashbanged every single time. It feels brighter today for some reason. Oh, really? I gotta get... Oh, this, this Charmander... Or Char... Yeah, Caterpie's traffic. Wait, where's my other Joy-Con? 
Wait, where is it? I, I do not know where the other joy. Oh, I see it. Is a lure on? It should be. Because uh, I haven't turned my switch off from the last time. But um, how about those Zelda leaks? I have not seen any of them. I know that the game's been leaked, but I'm just not like super into it. So it's not something I'm like really concerned about. Bulba's looking real possible right now. I don't, I don't think so. Let's check. I'll run the prediction though of over under 100 encounters. Do you prefer if I play on Switch or mobile? No, you can play on Mega Strikers on anything. I, I don't know. I want to play it today, but I just don't know what. What shinies do we already have? Uh, so we started this run January 1st. <laughs> um, and the first shiny we caught was uh, Nidoking. Because we thought he would sweep the entire run. So he... Uh, counts as one, two, three encounters because Nidoran and Arino, Nido King. And then we got Bellsprout, aka Throat Goat, who we refused to evolve. And then uh, we got Cappy the Ninetales because we caught it during the Super Mario Odyssey speedruns, uh, which also counts as two. We will evolve to Pink Worm when time comes. Um, I guess if they go over level, it's fine. So we actually should put them in the box. Um,. Because they're, they're going to evolve into not the pink worm. Um, and then uh, then we have the green sting, which also counts as three. Uh, Lady Luck, which was the most insane starter we, or Pokemon we've ever gotten. And then uh, there's Golduck. There, oh, I forgot. we got to level up the Pidgey, too. Yeah. Uh, that's the last Pokemon that we caught was the, the shiny Pidgey. Yeah, Throat Goat can already kill God, but you might be asking, well, why are you catching um, a billion Pokemon? Well, the answer is because once you get to Koga's Gym, in this game, they ask you, they demand it, they request that you have at least 50 Pokemon caught. And I know we could just go in and catch other Pokemon, but that's just not how we do it around here. It's a go big or go home. Is this a Nuzlocke? Technically, yes. But, um, I don't know. Yeah. Have you get a shiny soon? Thank you. I have nine wins in support of Team Alpha Red. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm glad to hear. Also, uh, can we just give a shout out? Isn't Omega Strikers, like, kind of, like, fucking sick? I did not expect the game to be as good as it is. I genuinely super like it. Very much so like it. The game's just very good. Yeah, it's amazing. No, huge fan. Is there any way to team with other members of the team Alpha Red team? Um, I mean, if you guys are playing Omega Strikers and you want to make friends with other team Alpha Red, feel free to just ask in chat and just say, like, who wants to play together? And maybe you guys can whisper and be cool. And that's let that be the extent of the conversation. Why do we have Caterpie in our party? It needs to be a Pidgeot. Oh, is a Mega Strikers back in popularity? Uh, it just like closed its doors for like beta for a little bit, so that's why like no one was talking about it for a bit. Uh, do a Discord channel? Nah, nah, <laughs> you're not gonna trick me. No, no, no. Oh, Odyssey Studios? Is that what it stands for? I don't know. Um, they have a community Discord you can go on. Okay, well, that makes sense. But yeah. Um, what do we want to see later today after we're done catching like 300 Caterpies? Do we want to see the Mario Party speedruns and try to get world record again? Or do we want to play on Mega Strikers? Because I'm super down for either. I will play... Okay, okay, actually, hear me out. I will play ranked Omega Strikers with viewers, and you stay. You get, you can play, but as soon as we lose one game, you're kicked off the team. <laughs> as soon as we lose one game, you're kicked off the team. 
does it matter if the other guy did better? Like, if you did better than the other guy, it's a team effort. Except me, it's not my fault. Just like real sports, exactly. Doesn't, I don't know how to play, but sounds fun. Okay, if you don't know how to play, please don't join. I, <laughs> I, I don't want to play ranked with people who have not played the game and are just downloading it. Like, whenever we get to it, I will ask people to give me their username and tell me how many wins they have for Team Alpha Red. Higher number gets in. What if your teammate is better than you and we still lost? Then they both get kicked. Alpha, I looked up the task speedrun of Mario Party Pinball Land, Mario Pinball Land, and it's seven minutes. It was actually fake. I don't want to brag, but I'm ranked high bronze. I don't even think I'm bronze yet, because I only played ranked for the first time last night. So, that's kind of where I'm at. But I'm, I'm getting the hang of the game. I like it a lot. What I hate about the PC games, though, on stream, is that given, like, where my webcam is, I'm usually, like, such a... I play so many, like, Nintendo games, I can kind of, like, sit back here. But when I'm, like, actually streaming, I have to get, like, super dummy clothes, and my head just looks, like, fucking tiny in this camera. That's always something I run into. Caterpie, please don't do this. It's tiny, though. Guys, we have so many Pokemon we have to catch. It's insane. Hi, Jacob. Hi, chat. Hi, Rickles. Is Jaden into Mega Strikers? I did get Jaden into a Mega Strikers. Uh, pretty much, if you ever see me playing a video game, you can probably assume that I have already spread it to at least 10 people. Think about One Piece, right? When I got into One Piece, like 50 more of my like people around me got into One Piece. Thousands of viewers even got into One Piece. I haven't made videos about One Piece, I just talk about how much I like it. An influencer at heart, you could say. Oh shit. Do not do the pose. Oh, he didn't do the pose. Caterpie's just playing hard to get. What about Jump Force? I do. When I played Jump Force, I haven't even read One Piece at that time. That was a pre One Piece Alpha Rad, which is crazy. Do you get anyone to read Part 7 of JoJo's? Eh, probably. I know at least Dylan. Uh, Dylan has been reading JoJo's every time he goes to the gym and reads it between reps, which is like the most bro thing I've ever heard. But yeah, he's. I think he's on like chapter. 45 or something he told me last time we talked. Make sure you use your Prime chat. Oh, that's so true. I mean, I, I did say that we would react to the... I, I don't think you guys understand how fucking good and embarrassing and good it's going to be watching the... Oh, uh, wait a second. At 8.5k... I said that we would watch my first since deleted Let's Play of Pokemon Sapphire. And if we hit it like on stream right now, I will pause the stream and we will sit our ass down and listen to it. Whatever you guys want. But yeah, if you have your Prime, awesome. If you don't, that's fine. Just beg loudly. You'll get a sub eventually. I just like Prime because you steal from Amazon. And I think it's funnier. Bro was struggling so hard to throw a Pokeball. Yeah, yeah, this is this must be your first stream. We have been struggling for a while. Oh no. Being a little bitch. A little bit of Oh, thank you for the primes though. It just a little call to action never hurt. I just want to see who just has one line. Oh, we run, we run, we run. If they do the animation and the ring doesn't disappear, they mean if you miss again, they're going to run away. And you lose your catch combo if you do that. So it's like, it's just not worth it. I could definitely just throw two Joy-Con and catch them every time. I'm just trying to conserve my Pokemon Pokeballs right now. Can you give Prime subs to people? You can gift subs, but there's really nothing different than Prime. Do, do you mean like... 
Give someone your one prime? Because no. Just I short answer no. Just short answer no. I, I think let's just say no. You could try. You could you could sure as hell try. What do we get if we reach the goal? Okay, so the big long-term goal is to hit 10k subs. Because if we hit 10k, we get every emote now until forever. We get 60 emote slots. And I will promise to fill all of them up soon. And by me, I mean Toasty. <laughs> and uh, we'll give you 60 emotes soon. You just have to give us time. And, um... But then... Um... I, I like... I've never... This is the most subs we've ever had uh, last stream when we were at like 8,000. And I just thought like... I've never really tried to push to a super high sub count. And I just kind of felt like, since we're so close, we might as well try. You know? Like, we could at least try. Um, and I mentioned it last stream. Um, but if you guys remember the egg lock, we're doing another one of those. But since content creators aren't funny, we are uh, letting you guys pick all the eggs. And to do that, you have to sub. Just check your prime to see if you have one. And then you link your Twitch to Discord, join the server, and then there's like a Google form just for you to fill out and submit an egg. And if it's unfunny, it goes in the trash and you waste the $5. But if you think you're creative enough to give us a good egg, it will be in the run. And then the save file will go out so everyone can look at it. I have too much faith in us? No, no, no. I mean, you have VGC in your name, Playmaker. Like, like I think you could probably give me something creative. Guys, we're 200 away from second place. Dude, we grind it. Yeah, I'm glad. I just told everyone to, like, if you're just watching the stream doing nothing, just play Omega Strikers and just, uh... Because not only do I want to reward that the game's good, I think the Creator Versus is the best, like, creator marketing I have ever seen. Like, let's talk about it. How many times do I do a sponsor? And let's be honest, I phone it in sometimes. And you just see it and you go, oh, that's cool. Or just skip it entirely. That's not just you with me. That's you with like 99% of sponsors, right? I think just the fact that they give the community something to hold on to is so smart. That is so good. I don't know. I just really want to reward that because I think it's such a genius way to go about exactly this. Uh, is it Gen 6? I think the egg community egg lock is Gen 7. But yeah, thank you for all the, all the subs. Caterpie. Oh, 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 we run, we run, we run. It feeds on my FOMO. That's, yeah, it's... I think it'd be cool. I don't know if they would do this. But I think it'd be cool if whenever, like, the, the Team Alpha Rat skin gets in the game. I think it'd be cool if everyone who supported it got it for free. I think that'd be cool. But uh, I understand why they can't do that. But I think it, I think that'd be cool if they did, you know? Plot twist, they give skin to the top five. I think it's only top three. I, I already talked to uh, the guy. Um, and I mean, we're, we flip-flop between second and third place a lot. What does first place get? So... First, second, and third all get the same things, but first place gets like, they're gonna make like a tiny statue, like a golden statue of first place in the, the like the hub, the the lobby for, for the game. So it's probably gonna be like the Moist Mogul's little, little teardrop guy. Um, so that's probably just gonna be a statue. I don't think it's gonna be Ludwig, I think it's gonna be like their logo. But you guys get what I'm saying. Is the subscriber Egglock a nug Nuzlocke? So, um, is the egg lock a Nuzlocke? Okay, let's try to figure this one out together, okay? Um, so, if it was just a casual run, we probably would have called it the egg run. The challenge the egg run. I don't know. Something. But, uh, yes. Mo most things that start with a word and end with lock, uh, are probably going to be a Nuzlocke. Yeah. Oh, does he, does he stay in the ball? Okay, no, he's good. He's good. 
I mean, I think like we even had the light locked. Where I've been talking about it for a long time. I don't know why I put it off as long as I have, but I, I really want to do uh, the World of Light, light the Nuzlocke light lock again. I want to do it, but as a randomizer, and I want the randomizer to add DLC in it, which I know it can. So I'll probably do that eventually. That might be a subathon thing. Yeah, honestly, that'll probably be a subathon thing. But yeah, there's a randomizer for it, and I think I'd, I'd want to try it. It's, yeah, because a lot of people ask me to do another light lock. And, like, the reason I did it a second time was because I failed the first time, you know? So it made sense to do it again. But it, it makes little sense to do it again once just because I've done it. You know what I mean? Like, it's just, okay, I've already proved that I can do it. What would you want randomized? Uh, it randomizes all... Uh, fighters with each other and then it adds um, DLC on the map and then it sw switches all spirits with each other so it's like you could just have to fight Pauline the first spirit if you want to uh, Wily might be required which could be pretty unfortunate if that happens what if soft lock it can't soft lock I could just lose Can you randomize boss locations? You can. Yeah, you, you can also do that. Does it scale difficulty? Nope, it's true randomizers. Hi, Harika. Uh, how does the shiny hunt go? Uh, well, it just really just started. So, uh, nothing or super report yet. Uh, 21 Caterpie down the drain. Uh, probably a few hundred more to go. What color is shiny Caterpie? Because I, I don't even know what I'm, I'm looking for, if I can be honest. You're just recovering from Omega Strikers? Well, I was just talking about Omega Strikers. And uh, am tempted to... After I catch the Shiny Caterpie, I might just boot up Omega Strikers. It's very possible. Are you down to watch or play? What I'm doing is I'm going to play with viewers... And if we lose, they get kicked from the team. They get to stay as long as they keep winning. That's the play. You gotta get the shiny soon. Well, the Charmander was found near immediately. Dude, I... The Charmander ruined the perception of the rest of the run for me. Yo, Meteor Smash 200. Thank you for the five gifted. Oh, and thank you for the 11 months. Hey, you've been here a while. Um, we are uh, getting there. I, I want to get to the... Honestly, I just want to... I'm kind of like pushing to 8.5k just because I want to... What? <laughs> I want to get closer to 10k, of course. But also, I really want to watch the old Pokemon Sapphire Let's Play. Oh my god, Necroke, thank you for the sixth gift. What a good number. Every time, like, I say it every single time. I'm never going to forget that six gifted. If you get five, ten, fifty, ugh, boring numbers. Two is so much more memorable than a hundred, you know what I mean? Seven, oh, that's special. No, no, that's something memorable. What's the current sub count? Uh, if you look below the stream, there's like a little button that says it. We're at a... 7.7k out of, uh, okay, well, now we're a little closer. Uh, thank you. Cracked Muffin and Slim Jim. Oh my god, Matt! 37 gifted subs! What a number! <laughs> what a memorable number! Holy shit! Guys, yo, know, can we spam the Ws? I, I just really want to show off that new emote. I really like it. But yeah, that's, uh, I heard if you spam it and beg, you will get gifted a sub. Yeah, 37. No, no, that that's something worth talking about. Also, if you look below the stream, I finally did the streamer thing. I put my social links, and I even got a little leaderboard of all time. Currently, I have gifted more subs than anyone else in my stream, which makes sense. But I fear that one day someone will take that from me. Alright, this water bottle is in here. for my life trying to get this water bottle out of the packaging. What the fuck? I come back and Pokeball gifted 68 subs? 
It would have been, I think the iconic combo would have been you gift one into 68. You get 69 total, but it's still more memorable. Thank you. Dude, that's so close to nice. No, that's the edging nice. Thank you for the, <laughs> the edged subs, man. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, we're so close to greatness. No, no, no. Guys, don't don't be mean because it wasn't 69. Be nice. They they were creative. Like, how many of you dumbass motherfuckers, if you had disposable income, would have just given 69 subs and go, <laughs> I get it. I get the joke. No, they're one step ahead of you. They're a little bit funnier than you. Alright, let's get wing attack here. Someone get 420? Oh, uh, we did get 419. Oh, Ray, holy shit. Motherfuckers just named Ray? Oh, okay. I had to look it up. I was like, gotcha. Okay, thank you, Ray, for the... What the fuck? 43 gifted? Holy, I can't even appreciate the subs. Thank you for the 69 subs. Nice. Less creative, but still thank you. Nice. That makes a lot more sense. I was like, who the motherfucker just named Ray? I didn't think that was your Twitch name for some reason. I could have sworn you rated me with, like, your full name before. Is that new? But also... 43 gifted subs. What the fuck? It, it's a shame. No, we we don't even have a hype train. I wish there was a button I could just force the hype train because I think you guys deserved it. Oh, he changed it recently. Got it. Okay. That's why I was so confused. I was like, yeah, how do you all afford this? Well, Ray's a content creator. And you, you can afford pretty much anything as a content creator. Like, I don't know. A life-size ace statue, perhaps. Maybe. Uh, and it, who knows? It might get here in uh, four to six weeks who knows who knows jay oh we're in second place on my mega strikers dude it's really that easy shit you know what maybe maybe we can get first place after all if we just stream it uh maybe, maybe that's all we need oh my god alter two think you're the four gifted honestly that four is so much more memorable than the 69 yeah never gonna forget those four subs Me and my friends uh, started screaming when you tweet about it, about the game. Dude, okay, so <laughs> first off, I want to talk about this. Oh, sh wait. L let me uh, like catch this Caterpie. Oh, no, I run. I run from this Caterpie. Oh, that was close. I was almost really bad. Um, oh, I just want to talk about... Here, let me find it. Um... Uh, if you follow me on Twitter, which I'm pretty sure most of you just do at this point, because uh, why wouldn't you? Uh, they verified me in Omega Strikers, which I didn't know you could do. I just uploaded my video, and then the next time I booted on, they gave me like a shit ton of currency and a check mark that just appears in game. And I get that it's nice. I understand that it's nice, but. It feels like when I was just alpha and no check mark, I could log into the game. They're like, maybe that's the real guy. Who knows? But I just feel like I'm going to get bullied. It makes me a target. Dude, if I was a random shitter and I saw a check mark, even if I recognize them or not, I am hard griefing that guy. Like, you know, I grief TTVs and Fall Guys whenever I saw it. And then the Omega Strikers Twitter tweeted this at me. Like, they fucking did it to me. I, th th I didn't even ask for it. They just gave it to me. I didn't want it. I'm going to get bullied. All of my games have gotten harder. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a lot, okay? <laughs> oh. But yeah, good game. Good game outside of them uh, putting me on blast. But yeah, thank you for... Okay. Alter 2 with the four gifted subs. See, I haven't forgotten that. Uh, Ray with the 69... Because, I mean, I remember that because I had to go check his name. Oh, my God. And Matt with the 43. But what was the other number Matt had? It was 43 and 37. Oh, honestly, I thought that would make 69. It doesn't. No, I'm surprised. Your shrine will be under the 100. Oh, that's pretty rare. Are you actually having fun? So here's the thing. I think shiny hunting is the most mind-numbing thing you can ever do. Would I say it's fun? No. But sitting here talking to stream while doing something that I know is going to turn into a banger video 
is fun. If you had me locked in a room and shiny hunt hunting on my own, like, that's my 13th reason why, you know? But, like, I, I could not imagine shiny hunting for fun. Like, that shit is foreign to me. Uh, I just like... Because think of uh, all the games. Like, I think in Pokemon or not, uh, Mario Pinball Land, when I played that, I read chat, like, three or four times. You know, it's hard to read chat and play certain games. But I like doing these streams because I get to feel like I actually talk to chat every now and then. So that's kind of why I like these streams. Alpha, how do I see all-time gifted subs? If you scroll to the bottom, there should be like a little tab that says month, week, all-time or something like that. Fuck it, downloading Omega? Hell yeah. No, it's a banger game. And they seem to really like me. And, which is good, because if you guys turn out really well, and then they're like, wow, they really, they really like this game, then I think they'll just give me more opportunities, and that'd be great. Who's your main in Omega Strikers? Um, I main Rune and Juno. Those are like the two characters I like. Do not say, damn, the Omegaverse kind of fire. Do, you, you, you're the, mo you're a mod, you're supposed to be better than that. You can't just drop that shit and expect everyone to be okay with it. You can't say that. I always ban Juno. I don't even think Juno's that crazy. She's pretty... I like her. But I like Rune more. And everyone bans Juno, so I just go Rune. Should I play uh, Omega Strikers on my Switch or phone? Uh, you can do it on both. You can uh, link your account so it's the same account on Switch and phone. Juno makes me think too much? Really? I don't... Have you played her? <laughs> I think Juno is a character that makes you look like you think, but in reality, you don't. It's kind of slow on the Switch. I I believe that. But uh, it's pretty good on my phone. I played it on my phone the other day, just to check it out. Rune got buffed, though? What did they do? What did Rune do to get buffed? Who's a good character to buy? I think it really just depends on how you want to play the game. Because my interpretation of it is like, do you want a character who plays the game or do you want a character who punches the shit out of people? Because that's kind of how I divide characters. It's like, there's the goalie, there's the forward, and there's the guy who beats the shit out of you. And that's kind of how I feel. Yeah, because if you want to bunch the shit out of people, just play Juliet or X. Like, that's kind of what they do. I've seen a lot of Juno Goalie lately, and I, I think Juno Goalie is insane because she can leap forward, hit the ball, and then teleport back to goal. Like, Juno Goalie, I, I think people are sleeping on it. I saw it the other day for the first time, and, and it's real. It's kind of crazy. Uh, sure, I'll learn Roost, because this is a Nuzlocke. I feel like it's really easy to forget that this is a Nuzlocke, you know, because it's been uh, four months and we've barely done anything. You know? <laughs> Rune's primary has X levels of kill power? Oh, dude, I have not been killing with him at all. That's crazy, though. Now I know. When do you think you'll finish this Nuzlocke? Uh, I think that's in God's hands, if I can be quite honest with you. I don't think I get a choice in when this Nuzlocke gets finished. I could stream it every day for the rest of the year, and it still might not be finished. You know, it's possible. It's, it's unlikely, but it's possible. As a pro... Wait. As a pro funnyman... What would you say is the most important thing to keep in mind for maintaining maximum goofy level? <laughs> um, you know what? Here's some actual good adv advice. If you treat yourself as a joke, and what I mean by that is a lot of people make self-deprecating humor. If you make 
like those kinds of jokes and you're doing it because you're coping because you're like insecure an audience will start to feel like they can also make those jokes so i recommend you one of two things do not make jokes that you do not want people making about you or two leave your ego at the fucking door if you're gonna do comedy that, that is my uh, two advice pieces of advice for anyone who wants to maximize their goofy level uh it's one you got to do one of the two What about being cringe? That's separate. I think cringe is past tense. You see, if you cringe at yourself, you have grown in that moment. You're never going to make the same cringy mistakes again. Uh, hi, Caterpie. Little guys. Being cringe is being free. Exactly. I've said it like every single time on these uh, shiny hunt streams. But when you're... If you look back at yourself and you thought that was pretty fucking cringe of me. I'm cringing thinking of that. That means you have grown as a person and improved. Because you do not think it's cool anymore. Oh? I forgot. We do have shiny Pidgey on our team. And I guess we do have to evolve them. I forget how long the evolution takes here. Oh, wait. I like him. A little more yellow now. This is... I think it's better because I couldn't even tell he was shiny last time. Um... Yeah. Okay, Jesus. You said on Deluxe that you can have low self-esteem and a big ego, and I've been thinking about that. I mean, it's true. I think a lot of people say, I don't have an ego just because they aren't happy with themselves, but I think an ego is more about pride, right? Like, it's how you want to be perceived and interpreted. Whereas, like, self-esteem is just... You know, it's, it's pretty different. I have far too much pride and far too low self-esteem. Yeah. Yeah, see? That's how it goes. This game is so animated. This game is animated pretty damn well. Some of the animations are recycled from Pokemon Go, and a lot of people pointed that out. But it's just like, yeah, that's how fucking animation works. Bro, if you can recycle animations, your job becomes a whole lot easier. Like, uh, people are saying that shit in One Piece right now of like, oh, like, dude, it's this shit's animated weekly, keep in mind, and it looks great, and they're like, they're recycling parts, and I'm like, fuck, yeah, they are. <laughs> yeah, they are. Dude, if I was Toei, I'd be recycling shit all the time. It's crazy that this is the best-looking Pokemon game on the Switch. That's what I've been saying. It genuinely is. Yeah, I think if you notice that people are recycling scenes, you should just pat yourself on the back and be like, I feel good for being able to recognize that, instead of, fuck these stupid animators for not thinking I would. They do it so dumb stupid kids don't notice. They're fine if you notice. <laughs> Recycling isn't bad as long as it's not in the same episode. Yeah, yeah, no, I agree with that. Because that's like something else altogether. Oh, wow, a lot of quick candies. I guess those are all from the Pidgeys, too. Yeah. Um, and I will go here. I'll sell like like 150 of those. I could probably do more. Oh, well. Huh. <sighs> That's the anime that recycles scenes in the OP. I think One Piece actually did that recently. Uh, I'm going to do like 60 here. And then I'm just going to get Pokeballs for the rest. Um, let's 
Pokemon Let's Go considered a mainline game? I actually think it is. Right? I'm, I don't... It doesn't feel like it sh is supposed to be. But I think this is a Gen 7 mainline game. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I always think it's Gen 8 off the top of my head because they, it came out so close to Sword and Shield. I guess they were off by a year. It's not super close. Oh, no. I wanted to buy more lures. That's why I went over there. Oh, I didn't need to buy more Pokeballs. Oops. Is there no practice range in Mega Strikers? Yeah, I, I noticed that. I was pretty shocked that they didn't have that either. It feels super easy to implement, too. Um, can I sell this for money? I'll sell, I can sell the elixirs for money. Yeah. Um, I can sell the berries for money. Oh, yeah. No, we're in business. We are absolutely in business here. What about these? Not much. Um... We're always going to need more of these, so let's let's just get like I'm just going to max out. I was on a team that was entire Wait. I was on a team that was entirely team Alpha Ride. We didn't score once. And we Alpha Ride emoted when the other team scored. A that's That's awesome. But I think you are misunderstanding the point of the of the event. No? Perhaps, yes? <laughs> yeah, banned from Team Alpha Red. You're letting them score goals. That's not what we want. Or maybe they got it, maybe they did. You know what? Yeah, they're they're just I'm just happy they're part of the team at all. Maybe this is why we're first. I'm starting to understand why we're not in first place. <laughs> it and the more you think about it, it makes a lot of sense. <laughs> it it sounds like that's the player base that would foster from the Alfred community. Is it's not about winning, it's about sending a message. And the message was we're fucking stupid. Oh shit. Oh hello. She's like, how does a shiny hunting nuzlocke work? Um so, I kind of... Normally, Nuzlocke, so like, you can only encounter the first Pokemon in your route. But uh, in every Nuzlocke, they always use the Shiny Claws. And a Shiny Nuzlocke is essentially just exploiting that. Uh, we just had to get as many Shinies as we can. It's just... To put it in a, like, full-on perspective, like... It is not about... Um, like, shiny locks are not really about the competitive integrity of Pokemon. It's about YouTube views, shiny hunting, and everyone gets to smile and point at the Pokemon that's a slightly different color. That's pretty much it. What was the longest chain before you got a shiny? Uh, it was Vulpix, and I think, Chad, does anyone remember? I think it was like 730. I think it was 734. And that was the longest by far. I think the fastest was Charmander. Uh, we didn't chain it, but I think we got like... I mean, how many Charmander... I want to say we saw like 30 Charmanders before we got it. Like, it was pretty quick. Maybe even less. Maybe even less. Yeah, it was like roughly 30. Oh, Bulbasaur, he looks so happy. Is the only point in the game... Like, okay, I thought I was just going to do a Shiny Nuzlocke, get six Pokemon, and move on. But when you get to Koga's Gym, he asks to see a Pokédex with 50 entries of Pokemon in it. And we just don't have that. We just do not have that. Will I eventually do Squirtle and Bulbasaur? Eh. I mean, I don't really want to try to Shiny Hunt the starters, because they're just... It's really hard to do it. If we have a lore, maybe it's, like, possible. But, uh, we'll see. 
Uh, I think it's it's in good interest to do it just because you get so many of them. Or you pick the game with the most arbitrary progression locks, shiny lock. Well, here's the thing. I thought I was smart because it's easier to catch shiny Pokemon in this. And honestly, a bit more... Uh, I'm just a bit more of an active player in this. So I thought it would be fine. But I was... Wrong. Uh, Dr. Phil V says, Am I a first-time chatter? Doubt it. Uh, well, let's see. Okay, you have said one other message before. Uh, and it was... Oh, shit. No, we leave. We leave. Uh, your other message was coming. It was on four, April 19th, 2023. And you said, just coming to say hi. So there you have it. You are a second time chatter. You have chosen Legends Arceus? Yeah, but that's just like a less cool Nuzlocke game in general, I think. Just because the progression is so whack. Like, I did a Legends Arceus Nuzlocke, and it was interesting, but it was not something I really want to do again. How do I find the Twitch sub role? Uh, you should just have it if you have your uh, Twitch link to your Discord, if you want to try and get in the egg lock. Yes, yeah, settings in Discord. PLA is a hard game to Nuzlocke. It's actually not hard. I think it's a pretty easy game to Nuzlocke because you get so many encounters in it. It's just a, an obnoxious game to Nuzlocke. Last day for Egglock submissions? Uh, no. <laughs> um, I think I will arbitrarily pick a day to end submissions just so we can uh, get more submissions. Uh, and I don't know when it's going to be. Maybe... I don't know. In like three or four days, I will end it. Sure. I think the next shiny lock should be Oris. Why Oris? I mean, I'm down to do them. It's just, it's just a lot. Team Alfred is officially number two. Love to hear it. Uh, yeah, I just want to secure second. I'm happy with second place. God, Rune is so hard. Bro, that character is brain dead easy. You literally click on the map where you want <laughs> a defender to be, and they just spawn there. Now that shit's so easy. It's free. Thoughts on Roost, Air Balloon, Zapdos? That doesn't really do a lot. I mean, if you... It's like Wonder Guard... I think, okay. If anyone is going to submit a Pokemon with Wonder Guard, I promise you it's already been done. I think the three abilities that I would advise everyone not to do. I keep thinking that Bulbasaur is shiny. It's just the, it's huge. It just looks so huge. I think do not use Wonder Guard, do not use Truant, and do not use Huge Power. Those are the three abilities that we have seen in obscene amount. Like Slow Start is just as bad as Truant, but you see it way less. Oh, Contrary. Oh yeah, you also see Contrary a lot. What about Prankster? Not really. What does huge power do? It essentially doubles your physical attack stat. That's that's essentially what it does. So you just make uh, strong Pokemon even stronger. Like Huge power goes on Pokemon like Mawile and Azumarill, who don't really have great attack stats. But some people put it on shit like Slacking and Garchomp, and it's like, yeah, no, those are going to hit like a, a motherfucking Mack truck now. Um, we're just going to move on, try to find more Caterpies, some more little guys. Shadow Tag? I mean, what does Shadow Tag really do in, in this game? 
they're, the AI isn't really going to switch out anyways. No guard with Oko moves would also be more common. Yeah, but I wouldn't take that because you have to think about what would be fun to watch for multiple hours. And if I have Oko, no guard, it's not going to be that fun. Lots of adaptability. That's, yeah, no, that's fair. I think adaptability is fine. It's just a good ability. It just makes Pokemon stronger. Like, okay, so my advice to anyone submitting eggs into the egg lock is you should have it be... Just think about, is there more than one strategy with this? I, I think that's the best way to approach it. Like, how versatile is it? And if it is only usable in one way, is it at least unique and funny? Uh, can we only submit one egg? I always say this. Uh, we won't know if you submit more. But no, Karma will get you, and it's kind of a dick move if you do. Huge power Alakazam is crazy. Oh, no, like, that's funny. Like, that's straight up funny. Because I think the funniest Wonder Guard Pokemon we saw was Shedincha Wonder Guard with, uh... What did it have? It had, uh, all recoil moves. It's Double Edge, Flare Blitz, Wood Hammer... And I think that's pretty goddamn funny. What the hell is here? I can't tell. Oh, it's just a Caterpie. Can you request stat changes to Pokemon? No. We are filling out over a thousand eggs. Please be kind. What about legal moves? I mean, you can give it whatever move you want. It can also be legal. Someone said, can I get a sub? Begging works, just trust me. Yeah. Fortune favors the bold, is what they always say. And, uh, you know, we wished into existence, and we just got, for some reason, some random rich motherfuckers just gifted us 200 subs in, like, a matter of 15 seconds, like, a few minutes ago. It really just do be like that. Can we get a tier 2? Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. If you do have a tier 2, uh, your little Alpharad sub badge gets uh, cat ears on it, which is, which is a good thing. Yeah, the <laughs> and then suddenly we have a tier 2, just like that. Tier 2, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Um, let me see. Uh... Oh, that's a real shame. Uh, I get Toasty, I tried to gift you a Tier 2 sub, but you cannot... I thought you could gift Tier 1s, Tier 2s, but apparently not. That's a real shame. I'm sorry, I tried. What the fuck? Oh, that Bulbasaur noise? That's so unfortunate, yeah. You appreciate it? Okay, yeah, it's the effort that counts. How much time left on the prediction? Yo, Matt, t -t 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 thank you for the 96... Not 96, the 6 gifted. Sorry, my bad. I read it from your name. But that's a, that's a memorable ass number. Oh, we hit 8k again? Holy shit. Oh my god, what a, what a day it's been. That is, that is an insane day. If we 500 more in this stream and it shuts off whatever I'm doing and we are playing uh, my first Let's Play uh, through Pokemon Sapphire, by the way. That's a goal for today. We'll break out whatever we have to. Whatever it takes. Because I also do kind of want to make it for a video. Uh, I think it'd be fun to react to my first video. Oh my god. Napick. Thank you for the, the five gift. I didn't even realize all the primes that snuck in in the middle of that. Thank you. Oh, and tri trip my wire. Oh, dude, it's been... Okay, 
So this is why today's been weird, right? A lot of people who sub are usually people who you've seen gift subs in the past. I These are like a lot of people gifting I'm like I've never seen gift subs like that before. So thank you for all the people who are randomly generous or maybe just got their paycheck. Uh, I appreciate it. I'm just surprised by it. Oh, Stripes Politics. Thank you for the three gifted. Uh, yeah, can we just get some claps or some Alfred W's? Yeah, is it payday? Or is it the... Is, I mean, I guess the first of the month was yesterday, huh? Maybe, maybe those are related. I, I feel like that has to be the only reason. Yeah, I just like the W emote. I think it's funny. And look, if you're a sub, you could also spam the emote. No, I like him a lot. I like. I think that guy's awesome. That's a lot of guys, actually. Can we mix it up with some streamer? Where is... Oh, the streamer's in the other room. My bad. Uh, can the P- I uh, chat's moving too fast. I can't see it. Sorry. I saw a lot of- is there an egglock deadline? Uh, it's in a few days. I don't know when, because I have not decided. Because <laughs> that's how I operate my entire business. Uh, I will probably start stream and just let everyone know this is your final day to submit for the egglock. And that will probably be it. You guys ever think I'm way too disorganized to manage an entire business with multiple paid employees? Uh, yeah, I have that realization like once a fucking day. And here I am. <laughs> managing. Barely. Oh, uh, it's, it's shocking. Opinion on JoJo Stone Ocean? I think it's very good. A fa oh my god, Schlick, thank you for the, the 17 gifted. What a number! <laughs> what a number! Schlick, good to see ya. Well, I just, I was trying to read. I was said, Esam said, fake it till you make it. Suddenly, oh, also, hi, Esam. Can we get some balds in chat? I wish I had an emote prepared just for that. How you been, man? Been a minute, huh? Uh, we've, We're just shilling, really. N nothing crazy. I don't know why I was so compelled to say that. But Eric, uh, Eric's Esam, by the way. Uh, yeah, good to see you, man. Joe and I had the realization um, where uh, this one, it's, oh, nice. Yeah, hello. I will be the pleasant voice in the background. Joe and I were having a conversation the other day, or just like how long it's been since we've actually talked to you. But every time Joe and I ever mention you in passing, we still go, oh, Eric's Esam, by the way. And I think that bit was a lot funnier when we saw you on, like, a daily basis. But we haven't seen you in years. And I just want you to know we still do that bit to each other. <laughs> and we have much less reason, too, nowadays. Because, I don't know. I mean, now there's Eric Point Crow in our life. So now we kind of have to specify which Eric we're talking about. Yeah, it's a good bit. Yeah, I think it's one of those bits that, like, the audience can't really make annoying. Like, they can spam it. But I think that's the the perfectly crafted bit because it's so nice by the way nice caterpie fob keeps it alive too oh my god i'm glad that we're all doing our part for the eric is esam bit for what it's worth though i think if esam were to get in a fist fight also eric esam by the way i think if he were to get in a fist fight with eric point crow that's a good question um I think Eric Esam is taller. I think, okay, Eric being Esam is taller than Eric being Point Crow, and I think that helps a lot. But I think Point Crow has also just got out of uh, chess boxing practice, like grinding, so I have to give it up to him for technique. But I think if we were to put the two Eric's in a fist fight, I think in the ring, um, Eric Point Crow wins. But if we're on the streets, I think Esam clears. You know, that, that's my take on it. It would be a good fight. It would be a good fight either way. 
Yeah, it, the Eric Eric matchup is like 70 30. I agree. Yeah. <laughs> Someone says Eric is bald, though. That is that is true. I didn't consider that. Oh my god, I looked away. I was bidding. And uh, again, I want to thank Schlick again for the 17 gifted. That's my favorite number, if you didn't know that. I have two favorite numbers, 4 and 17. 4 because it's uh, I'm it's my family name. I'm the fourth of my of my family of my kind. And 17 because uh, in grade school, I don't know if everyone kind of remembers this or if you guys even had it, but um, I like you would get lined up and ordered by like your locker number, or your number to get in line and everything to go to lunch. It was all or like alphabetized by your last name. Yeah, alphabetically assigned number. Everyone had one. Uh, mine was 17 because my last name starts with an R. So I was kind of like towards the back. Every class had roughly like 22 to 26 people in it. Um, so I was towards the back, but not the complete back. I was 17 for four years in a row. And on the fifth year, I was 16. No, I was 18 and livid. Um, but yeah, so I think I just was number 17 for so long. So that just became my favorite number as a kid. But then I really started to embrace my family. And I was like, I kind of like being the fourth. I like the number four a lot. So four and 17 are, are my numbers. That's kind of what I, I uh, look at stuff with. Also, everyone always says, like, you should name your kid the fifth. And I've always been like, no, I think four is a lot. <laughs> uh, I think five is going to be too much. But I just saw someone say you should name your kid the Roman numeral. And hear me out. I think I don't want to give my name to the kid. But having, like, the fifth and just name them V, I think that's kind of sick. Oh, my. Wait, okay. Ninpog, thank you for the eight gifted. Good-ass number, by the way. No, I like that. That's a good number. I'm, I'm about it. I think V's kind of raw. Middle name V? No, I mean, you could just name them like V-E-E. -E. Like, and it's completely unsuspecting. Like, you wouldn't know that it's a family name kind of being passed down through that. Because, like, I, growing up, I thought it was fucking obnoxious how every male in my family had the same last, or the same first name. No, I, I like V. Honestly, I never really thought about it, but I kind, I'm kind of about that. I kind of like the thought of just a kid with the name V, and it makes sense. Yeah, no, I'm about V now. It makes sense. It's, it's kind of like it pays them... Look at all these little guys. What are they talking about? <laughs> what, are they, what are they communicating with? They keep spawning in groups. They have so much to say to each other. With their such little minds, Bulbasaur has joined the fray, and he is scaring the hose, it seems. Let's just grab one. A baby convention, they say in chat. A little guy festival. Also, Nimpok. Yes, thank you for the eight gifted. And Rover, thank you for the six. I think six is more memorable, personally, but I appreciate it all the same. Hmm. There was a, there was one bit I saw in a Kony video recently where <laughs> I just thought it was funny because at the start of his stream, uh, whenever he was doing his YouTube intro, all chat was just spamming the day of the year. They just said 4-19-23. And I think that's funny because it dates the video so hard in the intro. And I was, I was like, oh, that's funny. I wouldn't mind if my chat did that, but I just think it would be hilarious if they did it in these kinds of streams, because these are going to be all over the place. If you, <laughs> like, you could, the clip that plays like two minutes ago in this video is probably from January. You know what I mean? And I know I did more, I, most of my shiny hunting was in January, but I, I know I came back to it in like February or something. Oh, we, oh, you're really going to confuse people when you start putting in, like, the... 
um, the international dating system. Like, when you start going a uh, day, month, year... Yeah, people are going to get confused. Personally, I think day, month, year makes the most sense. Because you go from smallest to biggest. But in America, I also get it because... Typically, you don't say, like, the 2nd of May. You would say May 2nd. So I understand why it goes May, like, month, date, year. Like, I get, I get it. I don't know. I think day, month, year just makes sense because you're, like, increasing the size. But you could also say the size of, like, the highest a day can be is 31 and the highest a month can be is 12. But they are bigger units of measurement despite that, you know? it's There's not really a right answer here, but I wish we all just got along. What about year, day, month? That one's crazy, though. I know some... Don't some, don't some people do that? I've seen some people write like that, and I just think it's crazy. If you aren't catching, why not use Charizard? Uh, because I... Could, because I, I, um, uh, it's because I am catching? That's why. Also, Charizard doesn't fly above encounters in forests. Fun fact. A Bulbasaur, hello. Hi, Pikachu. Yo, wait until e -San finds out Pikachu's in this game. Yo, man. Yo, it's like a reference, you know? You know, you, you get it. Chat, you get it. Are we at 100? Uh, we. I remember hitting 69 and saying nice. So I know we're like at the upper end of it. But let's see. Let's see how far away we are. Uh, that is 82 Caterpies. Still a ways away. Let's go to another part of the forest. I feel like we've kind of tapped that one dry. Uh, any Caterpies? There are a lot of Caterpies. Let's hang out with the little guy convention over here. Alpharet, Team Alpharet has 3k higher points than when I last joined. Hell yeah, that's what we want to see. I think uh, we can win in Omega Strikers. And I believe I believe in the team. Oh, did I say win? I mean get second place. Sorry. Yeah, yeah I believe we can get second place. That's all I really want to do. Yeah, second place is fine by me. Dude, okay, hear me out. What I think is fucking insane, that if you put Char like, if you put Charlie and Ludwig independently in Omega Strikers, like, they'd be number one and two. But if you put them together, they get a guaranteed first. That's crazy. Also, uh, I think for the sub, doesn't the increased shiny cap or odds cap at like 40 it's 31 is what you're thinking of but i've had a lot of people come into chat and say this because they that's how the shiny method used to work in this game and then people found out they were just wrong so uh i'll show you after i catch this caterpie uh, i have the lowest possible odds i could have or i guess the best possible odds i can have to catch a shiny but it's not of every pokemon it's of the next specific role. Like, roll R-O-L-L. -L. Like, uh, we are going to roll the dice once more to see if we get a shiny Pokemon. And after we catch this Caterpie, another Caterpie should spawn very quickly after. Show me that spawn. It was a Weedle. That spawn was a Weedle. It didn't count. Uh, but if that was a Caterpie, it would have been an increased odd. That's just, that's just how it works. Someone says, wait so I can swear? Sure. If you want to. <laughs> yeah, we're looking for the golden worm. Um, Guys, I gotta be completely and entirely honest. I, as an adult, cannot be friends with people who say frick. Oh my god! What? What the hell? What? 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 What is this luck? What? Well, dude, we have gotten so many shiny Pokemon just in a row. That is excellent. Why? Wait, no, wait, no, it was Weedle. That was Weedle. Wait, no, it was a Weedle, wasn't it? Wait, was that not even Caterpie? 
I, I failed! God, I, I just got... We caught the... Oh my god! Oh my... I thought I just... Oh my god! I just saw the shiny, man! I... It's... Oh... Oh... Okay. Well... That's not Caterpie, is it? So you know what that means, chat? We have to start catching Caterpie all over again. Does it count as a separate shiny? No, it does not. It, it, do, it does not. For the new prediction, um, I know I kind of fucked that one up. So I, I think we were like late 80s on the Caterpie train. So I will uh, give people 10 more encounters before I call the prediction on my fuck up. But in the future, fuck-ups will give points to the, the doubters. I thought we were incredibly under odds. It says it just shine. It does not count, though. That's the most unfortunate part. Didn't you already have one? Yes, we did. Yes, we did, chat. You are very correct. We chat look like just look at this. I think this just shows my mistake in full force. Ah, oh, okay. Look at this little bastard. Um I'll, I'll say, I'll mark him though. Uh, we're just gonna call this guy. Wait. Uh, I, I think it's only fair. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Also, chat. Do you spell imposter O-R or E-R? Because I always spelled it with O-R. And then I looked it up lately, or recently, and I learned that it's E-R. Yeah, it's actually E-R. I thought it was O-R. Impostor is correct. Er, incorrect. They're both right? They're both right? Do a poll? No, 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 no. No, I looked it up. I, I looked it up and they said that, like, people have adopted OR. So both are fine. But ER is, like, correct. Like, it is correct. Yeah, I don't know. It, it's... It's a... It's, it's rough. It's, like, gray and gray. Is it, like, a British thing? Because, like, in Pokemon... ER is how the imposter ability is spelled, which is what made me question it. So I don't, I don't really know. Oh, I looked it up and it said OR is right? Then why the fuck did I look it up recently and it said ER is right? OR is right? Oxford hit you with OR? Okay, I, I trust it. Yeah, I guess Pokemon spells it ER, though, I'm pretty sure. But sure. We'll, we'll go OR. That one's in Among Us. Oh my god, we have to try catch all these. I cannot believe I just saw the Weedle and I just... I didn't even think about it. I just saw the Golden Worm.
I can tie into that section very quick. Like, that moment is going to be very funny with a script leading into it, is all I got to say. I People told me Caterpie's golden. I saw the golden bug, and I said, fuck yeah. And I did not think about it further than that. Why do you need Caterpie specifically? Uh, because you have to get 50 unique Pokemon to move on. And we already have a Weedle. So I am trying to get Caterpie now. Oh, God. I can't believe I did that to myself. I can't believe it. I, I fucking can't believe it, man. I guess that was the first Pokemon we've caught uh, more than one of, huh? And the first accidental shiny we caught. Like, what the fuck is the point of having another Weedle? It means nothing to us. If we were to get a dupe, I wish we got, like, a Bellsprout dupe, so then we could actually evolve it. It also wasn't a Caterpie, so was it full odds? Uh, having Lure and, like, the chain combo definitely increased the shiny odds. But it's still, like, it's not full odds, but it's a lot higher than what Caterpie would have been. Unlucky for sure. Is anyone keeping count of the combo? Uh, I'm just counting to ten. And then uh, I'm going to call the prediction. Hey, Alfred, I'm here to ask you if you plan on doing your taxes soon. Um, no. Actually. So, I pay my taxes quarterly, which is a pretty content creator thing to do. Uh, which is a pretty self-employed thing to do. Because, think about when you don't get taxed for your money. Just imagine taking... Y you guys know content creators make a lot of money at this point. But it's because it's not taxed. So now imagine... Paying like 35% of that all at once. So, that sucks. Yeah, so most content creators I know who are like... There are two types of content creators. There are the ones who are making shit tons of money just kind of winging it. And then there's the ones who have like hired people much smarter than them, like me. I have hired a business manager to handle everything for me. So, uh, yeah. No, my, my company and me by proxy just pay taxes quarterly. Because... Paying that large amount, so what happens is I pay what is estimated for me to pay for the year. I pay that quarterly, and then at the end of the year, if I paid more or less than I need to, I either get paid the difference or I pay the difference. So that's that's kind of how it goes. Yeah. Should I ask why there are three Pidgeots? Uh, no, they're not shiny. It's just the, like, if I catch Caterpie and put them in the party, then they will have to evolve and level up and everything like that. The Pidgeots are there just because they're already fully evolved, and I just don't have to... It, it's just whatever. They're just fodder, essentially. Kind of wild, yeah, I just have to guess how much in taxes. I mean, it's it's estimated through, like, previous years. It's actually not that bad. Uh, usually you pay a little more than expected just to, like, balance it out. So at the end of the day, uh, you might, who knows, maybe you just get paid more. You know what? It, it doesn't really matter all that much. Your hair is looking wider than normal. Uh, it's... I mean, I got my roots touched up, like, uh... Either gone. Um, recently. Maybe, like, within the past week, so maybe that's why? Any leaks on upcoming gold videos? I mean, if you're a long-time Alpha Rad Plus, Alpha Rad Gold, or... No, I'm gonna say, if you're an Alpha Rad Plus watcher, you should just know what video comes out on March 3rd. No, I mean, you should just know what video comes out on May 3rd. Yeah, that's what. That's all I'm going to say. 
I feel like you should just know at this point. Do we know? Do we know? We don't have to say it, but I feel like you guys know. I think there's a, a good chance you guys know. Oh, when is the prediction over? Oh yeah, I'll give it to the doubters. Okay, so... Um, so this is going to be a little tricky. Because, uh, obviously, this new prediction... We are already starting at, like, encounter number... What? 12? So, you only have 88 encounters to win on this prediction. So... Um... Yeah, up to you. We did get a shiny. But it just wasn't the shiny we wanted last time. Honestly, I think the believers... Maybe the believers should have gotten it. I feel like some people should have argued that point more. Because I, I feel like there was an... If it wasn't Weedle, if it was a different Pokemon, like if it was Bulbasaur, I would have counted it. The Believers would have gotten it if it was a new... We did, I didn't see it. I think the Believers could have convinced me. I, I think all that needed to be done... No, no, I think the Doubters won. I'm going to say, I think the Doubters won because Weedle Shiny is worthless to us. What we needed was like Shiny Bulbasaur or something like that. What would happen if you see another dupe? I don't catch it. I just do not catch it. It's not a Shiny if it doesn't count towards the 50. I, that is the official ruling that we are using now for the end of the run. Payout about to be huge. Yeah, what does this uh, prediction look like right now? Uh, yeah, the believers are suffering, which makes sense. They usually are. But realize, I think the Believers have won a majority of the polls of the last few shiny streams. Because the luck has just been outrageously beneficial. Would Bellsprout count? I would count Bellsprout, yes. If we caught shiny Bellsprout, it does count towards the 50 because we're not evolving Throat Goat. Alpha, what if a shiny runs? It didn't count towards the 50. Therefore, therefore, we'll get there. We'll get there one day. I cannot believe my ass saw a gold worm and thought, found it. What happened to my channel points? Why are they missing? Well, did you gamble? Uh, just like... Uh, gambling, you give them your money, and then when the prediction is over, you get your money back. Or you don't. Depending on how gambling works. Yo, thank you for, th thank you for the three months. I cannot believe we keep fluctuating around this 80 number, but we're kind of like 8k subs. And I know it's embarrassing to shill as much as we have. But we are, like, sitting around this already very huge number, but what if we made it huger? Because at 10k, we get maximum emotes, and I will never have to shill again, and it will be glorious. So just check to see if you have a Prime. Anyone just tune, tuning in? Uh, and then if we hit 500 more subs, so I guess only 409 subs today. If we hit that number, uh, we will watch my embarrassing old content, and you guys can all point and laugh. I'll give everyone more emotes, and, uh, we'll be on our way to getting more emotes for everyone. It's a win-win. Oh, I don't have Prime? Oh, that's fine. Just, uh, beg very loudly. It has, honestly, it has worked. Um, just beg for, like, the oil tycoons and the oil princes of the world, and they will come through. Uh, when in doubt, uh, 40 anonymous tier 3 subs have come from the heavens above once before. But thank you for the primes. I want to do something on stream soon. I want to find more games where I can not... 
I don't want to necessarily like do smash viewer battles because like, I think that's boring. But I want to find like custom Coliseum was like a fun way to do viewer battles. Um, I want to do some. I want to find more games where I can just have people do dumb shit in. I could do an Omega Strikers tournament, but I feel like um, the thing about that is you're so likely to doing tournaments for games. People who are good at the games will find out about the tournaments, and then it's no longer a sub-tournament. You know what I mean? Like, that's what will happen. Maybe we just do a tournament where we just have people... Uh, we don't announce it. We just do it right here, right now. <laughs> Someone said, yo, Rockefeller, drop 100? <laughs> yeah, you could do that. Chat me out for me, and I'll give you a sub. Old Pixie, what... what what, what is your damage, is all I'm asking. Of you coming into my chat and asking people to meow for you. Like, what? what is your damage, is all I gotta ask. Everyone's doing it, though. My chat's not afraid to do it, that's for sure. Oh my god, my chat is corrupted now. Jesus Christ, look at what you've done. Look at what you've done. Are you happy? Are you happy with your decisions here? The hive mind does not behave. Toasty said, I looked away what happened. The amount of meows have summoned her yet again. I will gift a sub if everyone stops meowing. Just one. How about that, chat? Don't bark. Don't bark either. Chat. That is not the proposition. Ten gifted subs to shut the fuck up. How about that? How about that? I think that's a pretty good deal. Can we get some dots in chat? Can we get some nothings in chat going right now? Someone said I didn't mean to start the barking. I, I know you... It feels like you're a trailblazer, but I promise you, we would have gotten there one way or another. <laughs> Barking was the only next natural step. Yo, chat, I love seeing some shut the fuck ups in chat. That's awesome. Thank you for the dots. We love the sound of silence around here. Um, I feel... Okay. I, I'm so haunted by that Weedle. I can't believe that I just saw red and just went straight towards it. I didn't think. I just saw the golden worm. Why are we just catching Caterpies? I, I just like the little guy. Well, Fixie says, I'm sorry about riling them up. No, no, you're fine. It's all bits. It's all love and bits around these parts. This is the first Alpha Red live stream I've seen, and I don't know what to think. Um, it's honestly going pretty normal. It's it's pretty, it's about like according to script so far. I would say nothing out of the ordinary has happened yet, unfortunately. What was that noise? Oh, it's because I'm out of uh, balls. Got it. Alfred, are these long and grindy challenges hard for mentally and physically? Physically, no, I'm sitting in a fucking chair. Uh, mentally, uh, not really, because uh, look at the sub count. We're fine. <laughs> they, in fact, things are great. Now, nah, th this challenge is awesome. Oh, let's get rid of her real quick. All right, let's go sell all our Caterpie shit. Where do you get your ROM hacks? I don't know. Fucking Google. I'm just bored and chilling. I think that's why people watch subs or streams. I think that makes sense. Uh, I know we have a lot of great balls. But I...
Can we request for the guy stop meowing to be in the video? N no, it's, it probably won't be in the video. Um, one thing that, okay. So all the, a lot of these videos are pretty long, right? And I'm sure a lot of you think this moment was funny. Let's put it in the video. But like the hard part about deciding what goes in the video is about like what can be quickly explained with very little context. And I think that bit, like YouTube culture and live stream culture are so different. So where I feel like I would have to explain a little more than I'd like to. And that just pulls away from the video, you know? So I don't really want to do that because it's hard to explain. That's why, like, I honestly include very little of me talking to chat in videos just because I think it's it's hard for a video viewer. It just doesn't feel right, you know? I, I think is what I'm trying to say. It just doesn't feel correct. What about shorts? Um, I mean, like, shorts are quick bite-sized content, of course. But I think shorts are even more of an art form because it's like, how do I give people the required amount of context within like literally two seconds? That is, did I, oh, did I get repels? Oh no, I missed to get lures. Oh, that was a mistake. Okay, well, let's go sell those. I thought it said we had zero in bag and I was like, huh, that's weird. Okay, let's uh, let's sell all those. We're just kind of burning money here. Yep, there are the repels I just bought. Let's sell them for. <laughs> Oops. Okay, while I'm here, uh, I'll get rid of these. No, that's not worth it. Um. Oh, thank you, Isabel. I thought that was my friend, like Isabel, and I got I was I was surprised, but uh, it makes sense. That's just. A common name, isn't it? Because that's not Isab. Like I, I get confused. I thought Isabel was Isabel, and it messed me up for a second. Um. Okay, so now let's just buy some lures, and not. There we go. Uh, wasted a little bit of money there, but that's okay. Alpha is chat trying to count again. I don't know. I don't know why we're counting. I think they just want to be seen. Yo, I got a sub. Awesome. Congratulations. Begging works. Begging absolutely works. Opinion on Amy, Omega Strikers? I think she's cool. I think she's a fun character to play. A sub for the subless. Oh, you poor creature. I'll just... I don't mean to throw a premiere ball, but I guess I will. Have you tried out all the characters in Omega Strikers? Uh, I have them all because they just gave me a lot of currency, but I haven't tried all of them. But I think I know what they all do. But I'd like to get to my hands on everybody if I can. Do you actually enjoy Strikers, though? Yeah, I do. It's like it's hard for me to say that and be sponsored. But I think, I think you can tell when I actually like a game. You know, I don't, I don't want to say that on maybe other brands are watching. But I think like the two games that I have been sponsored to play, let's, because I don't, I, in the last year. I guess I've only done two dedicated sponsored videos in the last year. Because I think like Multiverses and Omega Strikers. I tr I'll do any integration, like just a quick, like, I'll talk about this game for 60 seconds. But, like, dedicated sponsored videos, I typically only make if I actually do like the game. Because I don't know how to act like I like a game with live commentary and face cam. Like, it just sounds too fucking hard to, like, make a compelling video over something I don't have fun with. So, uh, yeah, the only dedicated videos I have are, uh... Um, multiverses and Omega Strikers in like the past year, though. 
you're telling me that you like that weird off-brand Smash game that you lost footage for? Uh, I, I'd like to draw emphasis that I said in the past year. And I, I specified it. No, I... Also, for what it's worth, I thought Brawlout was better than what that video made it out to be. I I think it was just... I don't know. My video made it look worse than it actually was. <laughs> Which is not what a sponsor should do. Um, what I saw What About Multiverses, even though it bombed. Yeah, let's talk about Multiverses. Um, I think... If you guys remember Slap City, I have the same... The same argument I have about multiverses is the same argument I have about Slap City. Is I think the game was great. They had like their same they had mechanical shine to it. But and but like multiverses had IP. Multiverses literally had fucking everything that a Smash game needed. Because there are two things that Smash has over everyone else. IP and a unique idea. People will try to go too far in one direction. So they lean into an idea where it's so far removed from Smash Bros. To the point where it's not fun. Smash is the blueprint. You should make it similar to Smash. If, if you, especially if you want to appeal to the audience who likes Smash Bros. Um, and then there's the opposite direction where you make it too much like Smash Bros. Um, but Multiverses did not have the best visual clarity i think that is one of the biggest things the animations were very fast they were hard to read if you weren't well versed with the game and the impacts did not match the hits and there was no like hit lag like all of these things are very important for a game to thrive it doesn't sound like it is but you will realize how expertly crafted smash is when you pick up a home run bat with every single character charge it up and realize each of those characters has a unique animation for charging the home run bat. And then you're like, oh, what, what, whatever. And then you realize every character with a home run bat has a different jab, F-tilt, and dash attack. You know? It's when you start realizing shit like that, it's when you realize that's why Smash is above other games. Also, the game felt too floaty, but I think, I think being floaty is fine. I think floaty is good for bad players because it keeps you alive longer. Um, the other thing about multiverses is, again, I think Slap City was a great game. My favorite mechanical platform fighter outside of Smash. But here it is. The, I think what multiverses did wrong and what Slap City did wrong is that they listened to the people who play their games. It doesn't sound like it should be that way, but a game developer understands the insights, the interactions better than most of their top players. If you see the head dev of any fighting game on Twitter responding to people, that game is on a death sentence. And I, I'll stand on that hill. So you're saying Rivals is the best platformer? Platform Fighter? Dude, Rivals never had that big, bombastic blow-up. I think it can one day. I'm surprised that Workshop didn't draw more attention to Rivals. But Rivals has balanced the game against what the audience has wanted, and they've stayed. Because, look, let me paint you a picture. Let's say I am a Bugs Bunny main, okay? Bugs Bunny was pretty good at the game. Well, let's say the other person is... A lower tier main, let's say a Taz main, and they say, I fucking hate playing against Bugs Bunny because he's too goddamn strong. And then they keep saying, okay. And then they nerf Bugs Bunny until the Taz mains are happy. Here's the thing, they will never be happy. No one complaining on Twitter will ever be happy. <laughs> These are facts. So then, now you've butchered a character. And now the player base for that character is no longer having fun playing the game because you butchered their character and they've lost motivation and they're done playing the game. And then just rinse and repeat this with every single character. I, I think that's what happens with games. So, as a dev, I encourage everybody to trust that you know more than the people playing your games. Is this always the case? 
No, I think sometimes you hear some top players especially have phenomenal insight to what would make a character balanced, but realize that's, that's not a general thing. A lot of people only view the game relative to their character and their experiences. So I don't think it... I think there are exceptions. You know, like if you look at Smash, you know, I'm not going to say like Sakurai understands the competitive interactions more than MK Leo or Tweak, you know, because I don't think that's true. But you see what I'm saying. It's like, but they don't understand the repercussions of balance the same way is what I'm trying to say. But yeah, so that's my take. Um, I do not think game developers should listen to their audience because I think that they probably don't know as much and they're just complaining about their recent experiences. That's my take. <laughs> I don't know how hot that take is, but I think that's... And I think it's sad. I think it's sad because I think games like Multiverses and uh, Slap City had so much potential. I, I just think you just game just turns into like a little balanced hellhole as soon as you start listening to the fans. Nick All Star Brawl. I didn't keep up with All Star Brawl enough. Like I don't really know how that game was balanced. Uh, it's the same devs as Slap City, but uh, I I'm not gonna say I kept up with that game enough to actually know how it was balanced. So I'm not really gonna comment on that one. You know a lot once you've been in the scene long enough? I mean, I think me especially, because I've worked with most of these devs on these games in some sponsor, collaborative form of way. But I think uh, what what you really see is you see which games come and go, you know? Like, if you make it... What Multiverse did, right? They had IP and they put a unique twist on Smash, being the focus on doubles. That was great. That was a great concept. They had 10 million players in like the first month of beta being up. How do you blunt? How do you fumble that? And then, uh, and you get shit like rivals being like this constant, consistent force in the background. Not any insane highs, but they're always there. And now they're working on rivals too. Oh, you want to talk about icons? Oh yeah, icons is what if? I, here's the balance. If you guys don't remember, I, icons combat arena. Uh, this game takes the philosophy of saying. People like Melee. Let's make Melee HD. So they just kind of recreated characters and made that. That was it. Like, And then people, the game came out and people said, why would I play this when I have Melee? So it was kind of like a flawed philosophy from the start. Uh, and that game went under. Um, but then the from the ashes, the Phoenix rose and... Icons Combat Arena turned into Rushdown Revolt, uh, if you've seen that game at all, which kind of, imagine they turned Smash into an anime fighter, essentially, and it's pretty damn cool. Uh, I haven't really gotten my hands on it, but from what I've seen, the game looks pretty cool. Uh, what about Rivals Workshop took people's characters and made them part of the actual series yeah they did do that there are four workshop characters that became actual canon to rivals i wouldn't be surprised if some of them sneak into rivals too that'd be pretty damn cool um something else is Rivals Workshop, they allow you to put any character in the world into a platform fighter and have workshop support from everyone else. I am so fucking shocked that Rivals did not get bigger because of that. Because I felt like it could have been like the Mugen of platform fighters. I'm surprised people didn't salty bet over it. That's a genius idea. Why don't we salty bet over it? That's crazy. Is that how you pronounce Mugen? I don't know if it's Mugen or Mugen. I just try to not say it out loud because I've never been super confident in how to say it. <laughs> Ayo, new idea? Yeah, I would probably do that. I thought... Eh? I can't... 
cannot believe he got the shiny Weedle. I cannot believe I was duped. I was fooled. <sighs> because of the shiny Weedle. Hey, Alpha, love your voice. It's very soothing. Uh, thank you. I think it's nice when I talk like this and not in my YouTuber voice. I think the YouTuber voice is just to catch your attention. And here we are. Um, yeah, I was bamboozled by the wheel, that's for sure. I think it's just weird, because, like, if I'm... Is, is that a shiny? No, it's just the particles. I'm going to go investigate real quick. I just can't tell behind the tree. Okay, it's just a Caterpie. It's huge, though. Oops. Who is the most offensive character in Omega Strikers? Uh, if by offensive, you mean, like, wants to beat the fuck out of people, I would say X. I would probably say that. Oh, so many guys. There are so many guys here. X or Juliet, yeah. Those are kind of the I'm going to beat the shit out of you type of characters. Why do you have so many Premier Balls? Because I've purchased so many Pokeballs. How do I buy myself a Twitch sub? Great. No one's ever really asked that. They just ask how to connect to Prime and shit like that. I guess I've never just given people instructions on... How to just directly give me money. Could you imagine Twitch in like a, a non-Prime world? I feel like the economy for Twitch would be so different if we didn't have Primes. But anyways. Um, if you just click in the corner. Like you see this box? You see this? Okay, down. Uh, like right around here. That should have uh, like a little button that says subscribe. And if you click it... Uh, it shows you a dialogue box, and you can click your theater mode. Oh, fuck me, then. I don't know. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome for the tutorial. That was clean. <laughs> I'm glad it worked. Yeah, you just click that button, and there's a little checkbox for Prime if you have Prime. And if you just want to use $5, you can also do that. Uh... Digital assistant like Clippy. Someone said, "Wow, it's only five bucks." D did how much did you think it was? Because I feel like that's like a lot. <laughs> I feel like five's a lot, personally. But thank you. Yeah. The one thing I like about YouTube is that you can make the sub price as whatever you want. I think that's really cool. I think Twitch will probably get there one day. I mean, because, like, I think just how competing companies work is we'll always have, like, YouTube's going to steal from Twitch, Twitch is going to steal from YouTube, blah, 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 blah. It's, it's going to go forever. Lud has his at one. Okay, well, dude, if, if you have, like, a multi-million dollar YouTube streaming deal, yeah, you set your subs to one dollar. Yeah, no, I agree with him. Yeah, that's a good call. Never underestimate inflation. I'm surprised it's only five dollars. Yeah, I guess it's always been five dollars. I guess when you put it that way, whenever it was six on mobile, I thought it was six everywhere. But yeah, it just costs an extra dollar if you're on mobile. So if you're on mobile, don't sub, because if you sub for tier one on mobile and you have it reoccurring, it pay it charges you six dollars every single month, and that's a lot. That's just a, an extra dollar you don't need to do. Yeah, it's because, like, Apple takes a cut from App Store purchases. So, uh, yeah. Don't, don't do that. I, I think, I encourage my viewers not to sub on mobile because it is genuinely just a waste of money. Yeah, sub on your computer or beg. What if I'm not in app? Uh, yeah, I guess if you're using the Twitch browser, like in browser, it, it, you probably it's probably only five dollars, I would guess. Yeah, if it's not on the app, then yeah, you're probably fine to sub on mobile. What's my favorite Pokeball? It's probably Moonball, just because of, like you know personal aesthetics and whatnot. Uh, 
Alfred, is it hard to do the same task for hours? I realize I'm not really thinking about what I'm doing. It's not, if you, okay. Listen to how I talk on any other stream and you'll realize I am more focused on talking than I am on playing right now. Because if I'm ever focused on playing, I'm probably talking way less. So these streams are like glorified just chatting to me. It's like, imagine just chatting with like me ringing the keys in front of the viewers for like three hours. It's kind of like that. Proof being the Weedle? Yeah, no, I am not paying attention. His ass is not paying attention. Just chatting with Subway Surfers on stream? Yeah, pretty much. It is the Subway Surfers approach. Maybe on the next Shiny stream, I also play Subway Surfers in the background. Okay, this is too crowded. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna migrate. And read your top Reddit posts. I can also do that. Is it nice to chat or does it get boring? I like chatting. I mean, you realize that these kind of go in seasons of coming a lot and not at all. I think I'm just super ahead of content right now with like video ideas and recorded videos. So I, I and I'm kind of like, I have a lot of ideas I could do, but I kind of just want to take it easy for a couple days. So that's kind of why I'm just doing the shiny hunting stuff. I'll probably get back to doing more stuff like tomorrow. That's not like shiny hunting. I'll probably put it on the shelf for a little bit. How many shinies do you think you'll get this stream? Probably just, I was gonna say one, but maybe two because of the Weedle. How are you so social? Uh, it's an illusion. Uh, do you mean by me talking to you guys? I am in a room alone. Like, talking on stream does not mean you're social. It's so easy to mistake it, but I don't think I'm a super social guy. I think I have a lot of friends that I interact with intermittently. <laughs> That's the secret. Whew. I don't have confidence to talk to people like this. Well, when I first started YouTube and streaming, I didn't either, you know? Like, this is an acquired skill over the years. This isn't, like, a personality type. Maybe to some people it is, but I, I think... I think if you do anything for, like, eight years, you know, you'll figure it out. Shit. I still have 40 Premier Balls left, which is nice. Ugh. That first video will show a lot. Um, it, it could. I don't think it's going to be embarrassing. Because I don't think I would talk about anything super personal in the video. I think it's probably just... You're going to see a lot of, like, first YouTuber-isms. And it's just going to be embarrassing because it's me. What's my favorite mid-evolution of any Pokemon? Probably Hatchram. Uh, if you're talking starters, probably Duwant, or, yeah, probably Duwant. Um, yo, Solo Bagel. I Thank you for the gift subs. You drop subs every now and then. I don't know why it is. I really like the name Solo Bagel. <laughs> it just sounds so cool, but it just means one bagel, and I think it's funny. I just, I like Solo Bagel. Thank you. Good name. I will give a name review to the next few subs. And see if you can top Solo Bagel. Cannon come back, comes back like two hours later saying, God damn, Omega Strikers is fun. Yeah, no, no, it's a fun-ass game. Really like, I'll look at this. Sil Silvalum Knight. Um, I think it's, it's an okay username. I think I want something more to hold on to. Because I see that and I'm like, what? what is my name? Like, what? If I see you in a call, what am I just going to call you? Because I'm like, I have to question if I'm pronouncing that right. Runo Red, we got alliteration. It's short, no multiple ways to pronounce it. Love that. Airfall 3. I think the 3 
weakens your argument, but I think airfall, I don't know, just calling someone like, yo, air. Like, I don't know. It, it's okay. Um, uh, thank you. We got I smell like poop. Um, thank you for the six months. Uh, no notes. Uh, perfect, honestly. Uh, trust and toast. Would, would we just call you trust? I don't know. Or we call you toast? I don't know. We got Ari Bagel. I think Bagel just works. I, I think Bagel's a good name. We got Mr. Mirrored Panda. I personally... Mirrored Panda. I guess that you people call you Panda. I think Mr. is really weak. I think... I think if you have a first name that's Mr., the second word has to be a short noun. Let's say Mr. Beast, for example, right? Like, I, I think you have to make it snappy if you're giving me a title. Um, who, we got, uh, Di Dianosis? That's fine. That's fine. It's, it feels more, I don't know if it's a thing, but it feels a little edgier than, than I'd, I'd like. Um, OBC Family? Fucking, what? I, I, don't, I don't understand that one. And then we got Sesame Shrimps. You know, no notes, no notes. Sesame Shrimps is he. And then Strider Inc. Oh, Solo Bagel. Oh, thank you for the 10k bit, Solo Bagel. We strike again. Uh, Mr. Flame Gator. Okay, first off, Flame Gator is hilarious. Uh, no shade, but it feels like you came up with this name in like elementary school. And you just kind of stuck with it. Um, thank you for the three months and the constant support, but I said what I said. Cosmic Sunsets. Um, I guess this is just what we're doing right now, huh? All right, shit, okay. Flame Gator goes crazy. I think Flame Gator can go crazy, but Mr. Flame Gator, like, I, I think it's just like, what is a good username versus what is a good brand name? Because, like, there are some names where I'm like, yeah, that's a fun username, but, like, could you make an identity out of it? But I guess not everybody is trying to do that. Whoa, Striped Swallowtail, thank you so much. I'm just gonna assume you like birds. Trap Swallowtail. Awesome Sauce 97447. Banger name never change. Um, Trap Swallowtail. I don't really know. Um, I think like I see usernames and I always want to know, like, what is the shorthand I would call this person? And I guess I'd say Stripe? Striped? I don't know. It's a long name. Um, I'm Brag of Pluto. Okay, I had to go a little faster. Okay, uh, we have so many names. Cosmic Sunsets. Uh, I think Cosmic is kind of like a name you hear a lot. Um, I think Cosmic is a beautiful adjective, but a little, little all over the place. Oh, Captain Free Time. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Uh, what's okay? Super funny lore drop. I know Brayden's talked about this, so I feel fine in it. Uh, you know Brayden, Captain Kid. Uh, well, I was the one who told him that he should. He needs a, like a snappy name. Because he used to go by CZS. Captain Kid, when we met at Smash tournaments, he was uh, known as CZS. And that was an acronym that stood for Captain Zero Skill. So he kept the captain and just went a little shorter. But yeah, that was a Captain Zero Skill for a while. Oh, yo, Mr. Video Game 22 resub for 31 months. Hell yeah, Mr. Video Game. Kick ass. Uh, I can't read all these subs now. You guys are gifting them too fast. Oh, it's a hype. Yeah, the hype train does make sense. That's right. Roast my username, please. What was it? Foul and basket? I, I don't know. It sounds like a command or a question or a concern. I don't understand what you want me to do with that username. I really did like Mr. Video Game, though. That one's funny. Kahoot randomized ass name, yeah. Will you change... Will you do Sonic Frontiers again? Ah, uh, I might do modded Sonic Frontiers eventually. I think the YouTube video performed a little, little worse than I wanted it to. Because, like, you have to view modding as, like, time investment. Of, like, is it worth getting people to do this? Second Island's already done, so I'm probably... I will at least do the second one. And we'll just see. We'll just see. Uh, if I don't have anything to stream, maybe one day I'll do it. But uh, it might be like in a subathon or something just when I have... I'm like, yeah, sure, we'll do it. We'll see. 
The stream was very funny, though. I wholeheartedly agree. How'd you land on Alpharad? Do you wish you had something different? Eh, not really. I think... I just liked Greek letters. Like, that's all it was. Uh, I think it's a little cringe when people confuse it with, like, Alpha Male, because, like, that's not... That's not the energy I'm putting out there, I promise you. Uh, it's just I like the Greek alphabet, and I thought it was really neat. A lot of people think it's Alpha Radiation. That's what a lot of people think. I, I think that would have been cool if I did come to the conclusion of Alpha Radiation, but... It's, it's not. If people think that's the case, I'm fine with that. Like, that's a pretty badass uh, uh, conclusion. And thank you, DeLong God, for the five gifted. DeLong God. I I don't even know if DeLong is a real word, but I always think Tom DeLong from Blink-182. So when I see your name, that's the first thing that pops in my head. And now him is like an immortal being. So I think the imagery is strong, but that's what I think of. Tempo control? Damn, if you just went by tempo... Man, just think about a motherfucker in your friend group named Tempo. No, that shit's heat. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure no, most people don't call you... The, tempo control is like the full government, you know? Like, I don't have to say all that. Mr. Mirrored Panda? No, no, no. Thank you for the 300 bits. You do not have to rethink your username. Oh, right, you think something snappy would be nice? Sure. Yeah, maybe. Athena L. Dude, I think Athena is one of the most badass names of all time. Any, anyone with Athena is it's just on my list. Like, I'm like, that's sick. No, no, you're good. Wait, Desi does pizza. That's an awesome name. <laughs> I Do you stream making pizza? That's, that's all I can think about. But I, I'm glad you do pizza. That's cool. Skyla Rose? I think. I think that's cool. I think some people have cool first and last names. And I think that's really cool. Like, I know... Dude, you know Inferno Omni? That dude's name is Steven Silver. That's badass. Why does he go by Omni? You know? I know Dark Wizzy, his real name is Rasheen Rose. What the fuck? These are like Clark, Clark Kent, like superhero names. Like, how do you come off these like edgy usernames? Yeah, yeah. Steven Silver is like an MCUS name. I agree. Yeah, no, I think that's crazy. Rate mine? Okay, what, what did that say? The Beans Man. <laughs> you want me to review The Beans Man? Uh, uh, I, dude. No notes. <laughs> no notes. Uh, the perfect name. No, the bean man can stay. <laughs> it's flawless. It, it's perfect, even. I like the bean man. God, I looked away, and uh, we're at a level 11 hype train just from reviewing names. And these are just kind of sitting here collecting dust. Crazy how that works. But thank you for all the gifted. Oh. We will catch this Caterpie eventually, and by catch, I mean, it, it won't be a fucking Weedle. Ugh. Ugh. Oh shit, I just realized we're at 8.2k? Oh, we are creeping up on it. Shit, it's possible for us to hit it today. Uh, to watch the silly funny video. We just need everyone to check to see if you have Prime. Tectonics? I'm a fan. Of Rodin? Of Rodin. Uh, Avradin? I think it's cool. No matter how I pronounce it, both ways are cool. Uh, I accept either as being cool. Whichever one's correct. Um... Will I play Tears of the Kingdom? Yeah. Opinions on names with YouTubers? What the hell does that mean? <laughs> Sometimes there are things just said and I just don't really know what they imply. I summon the oil kings of the world. I, man, if it works like that. If it works like that. You ever just... Uh, sometimes I go into people's chat and like I will find like a channel that has like 
30 to 40 viewers. And then you'll see him like gifters and there's just one motherfucker with like 1200 gifted subs in the past month. And I'm just like, who the fuck is that? You know, I, you, you guys know what I'm talking about. You've seen it before. Cause money laundering. I don't think it's necessarily money laundering. I, yeah, I think it's just every, it, yeah, it's, I would say 60% chance money laundering. But yeah, I see that and I'm always like, what happened? Because I assume there's a story. Maybe the oil prince has found his favorite Twitch stream. It could just be that simple. Fetish, maybe? Uh, thank you for censoring fetish. <laughs> but, I mean, yeah. Yeah, it could probably be something like that. I'm not going to say it's not. I think it'd be a little ignorant to say it can't possibly be that. Some dude just likes giving all his money away to this streamer who is reacting positively to it yeah i think that's definitely possible and is probably the case a lot who is my favorite youtuber oh, i don't know who do i watch the most i think the one youtuber where it's like drop everything they just put out a video is probably summoning salt but i don't know if i could say like summoning salt's like my favorite youtuber but you know what I mean? Like, it's like an event. Who do I end up watching the most? I'm trying to think. I think this is like a, a, a little vain. But... I, I think a, a lot of my favorite... I guess, no, this isn't vain. A lot... I will watch pretty much anything that sounds appealing to me you know, whatever the algorithmic gods are feeding me down my throat, I will just consume. But the only content I really go out of my way to consume is like videos my friends post. I'll probably watch like anything my friends post because a lot of my friends are content creators. So I'm pretty, pretty eager to watch anything they do. Like, yeah, I was, I was going to say was, well, okay. What I was originally going to say is I really like Captain Kid's content because I think we make very similar kinds of content. And that was a little vain. So that's what I stopped myself from saying. That's what I was going to say. Because <laughs> then it can almost come off like, I think I would be my favorite YouTuber. Yeah. Jaden is kind of like, I mean, it's like Summoning Salt is always the, the I like drop everything and watch. But it's like with Jaden, I just work so close with, closely with Jaden where I've like, by the time her video has come out, I've probably like already watched it, you know, <laughs> just by seeing her work on it. Oh. I don't know if he did the animation or I was leaving. Yeah, but I like, it makes sense that I like watching people make videos similar to what I make because uh, I make videos because I would like to watch them, you know? Like people make video, people, the video game people develop are probably similar to the game that they would like to play that doesn't exist. You know what I mean? Yeah, if you make content that you would like, it makes sense that you would like similar stuff, yeah. Uh, do your friends watch gold? It's kind of a lot. Uh, I don't really think so. I never really expect anyone to watch gold, but every now and then someone will tell me that they put it on in the background. I don't think any of my friends are like avid Alpha Red Gold watchers, but I, I think that they are at least familiar enough with the channel to know what the point of it is. Oh, yo, level 12 hype train. Oh, holy shit, thank you. Oh, oh, also, especially thank you for letting it die before it gets to the hype tray. Or the fucking cat ears. Thank you to all of you. Much appreciated. Mmm. That's exactly what we want to see. Enough to inflate the sub count, but not enough to uh, wear the ears. It's a beautiful day. Oh, that sound always scares me when you're low on Pokeballs. 261 left? How close are we to, like, actually hitting the sub goal? We are pretty close. We, this, I think, right now is the highest sub count we have ever had. Like, again, we have reached the peak once more. Which, uh... Oh, wow, thank you, Matt96, for gifting another 10 subs. Uh, th that is a lot altogether. And 
then. And then the flame is going to die out in a single blow. Thank you, guys. Thank you for just the right amount. <laughs> now, we'll still hit that sub goal, though. We tried. Eh, it's okay. We can still... What? We are less than 250 away. Dude. I can't wait to get 10k and then have to stop shilling. Because I feel like I just... We're so close to it. We might as well push as hard as we can. But I, I feel a little annoyed at myself. Don't worry. You're not the only one. I just want to catch shiny guys, man. I feel like we've been here for so long. We even caught the wrong shiny guy. I just want to find the shiny little guy. What if we find a shiny Metapod? <laughs> that would be unfortunate. Well, you take it, but it's just funny. Uh, Solo Bagel, thank you for the five gifted. Calc Gamer. That's an awesome name. And Bidoof Boy. Take my money, funny Pokemon man. I, I guess that is who I am. I want to... Uh, I said earlier, I haven't decided yet. Do we want to do another Mario Party speed run after we find it? Or do we want to play on Mega Strikers for a little bit? Because I'm kind of down for, for either. Talk amongst yourselves. Figure it out. I think, I think we just talked about Omega Strikers. I do have world record on Mario Party, to be fair. So... Do a poll? No, I just want people to scream for a little bit. We'll figure it out later. Mario Pinball is not on the list, though. No, nobody needs more Mario Party or Mario Pinball. No, we are good without that. Caterpies, please. I'm not going to be fooled by a Golden Weedle once more. If we see that guy, we are running. So, so many fucking guys. It's tiny! Oh my god, fucking arm of a quarterback over here. I thought about doing like a subathon type stream where I 100% uh, Sonic Adventure or, or Sonic, yeah, Sonic Adventure 2 because I would like to get the Green Hill extra level because I never got it as a kid. So I think it'd be fun to like avenge myself as a kid and try to get that. Get all emblems essentially, yeah. Um, I, I wouldn't know the speedrun route, so we would just, you know, do it <laughs> as many times as it took. Yeah, there's a Green Hill 3D zone. Oh my god, some of these people don't know about this. Wait, hold up. Wait, yeah, wait, we're gonna take, take a little break real quick. Wait, I just messed up my TV. My monitor, hello. Okay. Well, let me let me pull this up. Um uh Green Hill SA2. Yeah, I'm surprised. Not a lot of people seem to be aware of this. But um if you get every emblem in Sonic Adventure 2, you unlock Green Hill Zone as a bonus level. It's look, it like starts in the, like the 2D perspective. And then it, you know, not everyone was aware of this. Yeah, it looks modded. It honestly just does not look great. And it's not that special. <laughs> like, it's like a cool, oh, that was fun. But you beat it once and that's it. <laughs> You've never seen this. Yeah, this is not modded, by the way. This is 100% not modded. But, uh, yeah, this is, it's just in the game. And you can see it kind of, uh... Lines up with Green Hill. It's a Green Hill Imagine in 3D. Uh, we'll skip. Oh, what the fuck are we doing here? See, they even have one of those. Oh, that looks like it, it works. And, uh, yeah, you just keep going. And then there's the gold ring. I wish they had, like, the little spinny pull for this. Yeah, it, I think it's so funny 
is it doesn't even look good. <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, it just doesn't look all that good. Um, but yeah, the unfortunate part about 100%ing Sonic Adventure 2 is you also have to 100% Chow Garden. So that's like a, the main thing we have to do. So, uh, may, I'll do it one day. Uh, that's a stream I want to do. I, probably, like, I'm already in a subathon context. I would, I would probably try to 100% the game. It's masochism. You need to play the... Well, here's the thing. I've gotten very close to 100%ing Sonic Adventure 2 in, like, high school. So I know it's not impossible. I watched the speed one speed run route of it. So I at least know some tricks that make some levels faster. Like there's some wrong some wrong warps that make the most obnoxious of levels a little bit more tolerable. So I'd probably utilize some of those. Cuz like there are mods that will show you what score you need, what time you need. Because some of them are time-based and some of them are score-based. Yeah, we're coming up on 100 encounters, though. And we are just, what, 240 subs away. I think what's so fucked is, like, the past month has really skewed the sub economy for me. Because if we got 240 subs in a stream, I'd say that is an obscene amount of subs. And then people are just gifting 240 subs in like five seconds. And it's like, how the fuck did, what, what changed? Literally what changed in this month to the last one? I don't know. It's been fucking bonkers and I don't get why. Egglock? No, 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 I get Egglock. I get that we've gotten a lot of subs from Egglock. But it's, you cannot say, we had a high number of subs before the Egglock. People like you? I Okay, I think that is the answer. I'm just surprised they like me that much, I guess. It's really easy to forget when you're just in a wall talking to yourself. In four walls talking to yourself. And then suddenly there are real life people. Like, I don't think I'll ever get tired of people recognizing me and taking pictures. Because it just doesn't feel right. Um, when I see a video gets like 2.5 million views... I go, that is a lot of that currency, the currency being views. But I just don't think of it being like actual people. 2.5 million people is fucking crazy. Anyways. Um, do we want to see what Pidgeot looks like? Uh, what's cool is like, I don't know what a lot of these shinies look like. I'm just kind of going in blind. Oh, look at that little piss boy. Oh, I like the golden bird. Shout out Juno. Oh, 98 Caterpies, though. We could, yeah, don't call him that. What? He's a little piss boy. What's wrong with that? I'm not going to try and act like he's not. Um, Dude, look at all these fucking bugs. I, I don't need... They've built a barricade. I can't even... I, I cannot... Get, oh, barely. Barely got through there. All right, I'm just seeing. What if a little Caterpie just spawns? What if he just appears? That's not Caterpie. I, I've learned the difference of Caterpie and Weedle at long last. I'm just gonna do my rounds real quick, just to at least give the believers the best possible chance they can have of just doing my rotations, because they can just spawn. Um, what if he just spawns right now? Oh, okay. Well, that was almost. What if? What if it worked though? This is kind of what I'm saying. So many guys, and Weedle, and Metapod. Is this inspired by Johnstone? Um, kind of, yeah. I mean, I did the... I've done Shiny Nuzlocke's before in Hard Gold Soul Silver, and that was fun. And I was open to do it again. And I heard that Let's Go was good for Shiny hunting. And then Johnstone's video came out. And then I was like, yeah, this is the game I'm going to do. 
I, I did know beforehand that uh, I would need to catch 50, but I was like, who cares? These go so fast, it'll be easy. And then I realized, uh, uh, fastest relative. <laughs> fastest very relative. Legends Arceus is so much easier. Yeah, but the combat is just not like that fun. So I didn't really want to do that. I guess the combat's pretty easy when we have a drugged up uh, bell sprout. All right, and that's the prediction, guys. Uh, the doubters have won once more. Um, let's let's go back. Let's set one for two hundred. Okay, we'll migrate over here. <sighs> Would I have played Arceus more if I had online doubles with its mechanics? I'll keep it real. I do not possibly understand how you can play multiplayer versus in Legends Arceus. I do it just, especially doubles? I, it sounds super toxic. It sounds like the fastest Pokemon just get rewarded because they get to attack multiple times. The game, I don't know how you would do it. But I would be open to try. I think it could be pretty fucking funny. Uh, we'll see. Oh, are people starting to believe in this run? Oh, there are a lot more believers than doubters now. They've cashed in. I see someone say, I am now a team believer. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I think if someone could make an engine where you play uh, Legends Arceus competitively, that would be funny. Because it just it sounds hard. I'm team payout. That's fair. Uh, can we get a point, like a channel point count? I just want to hear what everybody has. What's your total count before the before you just put stuff in? Because there are some big numbers in chat. Like I am shocked at how many big numbers there are when it comes to point total. I've lost thousands. That's understandable. That'll happen when you gamble. I think what's so funny is people will gamble all their points and then be upset at me that they lost. Oh, you have 173. You got Twitch today. Well, are you winning, son? Did you get some? Oh, my God. One time I went to a house party and there were there was a couple who had a kid. They brought their kid to a house party. But the theme of the party was that everyone had to... It wasn't... I guess it was like a day party. Um, and everybody had to dress like a dad. I post pictures of it a while ago. Everyone had to dress like a dad. And someone brought their kid. And I guess, you know what? That's kind of funny that that's the theme of the party. So someone brought their kid. And I thought it would be funny to keep up with the dad vibe. And I don't normally say it, but I looked at this kid because he was playing pool on the pool table by himself. And I said, are you winning, son? Because, you know, I'm dressed like a dad. We're all dressed like dads. He's at a dad party. You know, I thought it'd be funny. And he just looked at me and goes, why'd you say that? That's not funny. Why'd you do that? And I just go, oh, oh, my God. I don't. You, I, you're right. I don't know. So I just like kind of turned around and left. And it's just. I've thought about that instance a lot. Like, it's just... Kids are honest in a way that hurts. <laughs> Every time without fail. <laughs> How old was the kid? Maybe like... 9, 10, 11? I'm gonna say like 10, 11. Yeah, yeah, yeah mean kid. Also, shout out Hayden, shout out Eric. How are you guys doing today? Uh, I'm back on the, the 9 to 5 life. Uh... In a, in a different time zone, I guess. The night shift of my shiny hunt. Ah. 
You're insane. Hey, look, okay. Uh, you want to see? You want to see how many hours we've logged so far? Let's take a look at this. <laughs> no speed up, by the way. No speed up. <laughs> no speed up. Forty-four hours. Yeah. Uh, and we're not even halfway there. So, we caught an ample amount of Pokemon. And then when you get to the fifth gem, they request that you have a Pokedex of at least 50 entries. Which I almost have. I didn't at all. A lot of people said, just go catch 50 Pokemon. Who cares? But I think I'm the kind of guy who commits the bit. And now I am going to catch 50 shiny Pokemon. So, uh, if you want to look at the box, um, we have... One, two, three, because Nidoran, Nidorino, Nidoking all count as different Pokemon. Bellsprout, but we refuse to evolve Throat Goat because, I mean, how could we? This Pokemon is perfect. I mean, look at those stats. Wait, someone said Kakuna there. What? Kakuna's... What? No, I thought you meant like he was shiny. And I was like, well, if it did, we'd fucking ignore him. Um. So, yeah. We got uh, one, two, three... Four, five, six for Nine Tails, seven, eight, eventually nine from Dragon Knight, ten, eleven, twelve from Weedle, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen from Charizard, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen from Golduck, and then we caught an extra Weedle on accident. So. Yeah, that's uh, on our path to 50 Pokemon. Oh, and then Pidgeot. I forgot. Where's... Oh, our Shiny's down here. Yeah, so 17, 18, 19, 20. We are at uh, 20 Shiny Pokemon out of 50. Just released the Weedle. No, man, look. He didn't do nothing wrong. He didn't do nothing wrong. Is there even 50 this early on? Yeah, of course there is. <laughs> Could you imagine... If no one's commented on that at all so far. Yeah, there are 50 Pokemon in the game. 20 shiny Pokemon in 40 hours is actually impressive. Well, it's more of like 7 or 8 shiny Pokemon in 44 hours. Because they have just evolved. But yeah. We'll, we'll get there eventually. We sure will. Um, but yeah, what a, I just like these streams because I just get to talk to chat. Like, it's really just a just chatting stream that will turn into a banger YouTube video. That's kind of how I got a view at this. How do you do this without running out of money in the game? That's a great question, but every time you catch a Pokemon or release it, you get candy. The candy only sells for $10. But uh, once you get a catch combo, you start getting a fuck ton of candy uh, that also sells for $10. So every now and then, you just dump your candy, sell for, you know, all 999 that you have, and then you just get more Pokeballs. It just kind of feeds into itself. It's such a good stream to put on in the background playing on Mega Strikers and being, you know, on Team Alpha Red and collecting wins for us so we can get second place. I think real shit, if I stream like every day and push people into Mega Strikers, I think it would be possible for us to overtake one. It'd be the true Cinderella story, but I just don't know if I have it in me. It sounds like a heartbreaking goal to be wrong in. We're in second place, exactly. It's not you are in second place, me in second place, it's us. Team Alpharet, we're in second place. We can do it. We can at least get top three. Oh, Ludwig's in first? Yeah, yeah. Lud Ludwig's in first. Yeah, yeah. It's not just Ludwig. It's a combination, a joint effort of Ludwig and Moist Critical. How in the fuck is any content creator supposed to combat that? J like, honestly. Like, <laughs> that shit is hard. Mr. Beast? Okay, fine. Yes, Mr. Beast could have won. I agree. Do you prefer people calling you Alpha or Jacob? 
I don't really care. I, uh, I'm good with either. If you are, like, talking to me in my DMs, uh, I prefer the first name basis, because I think it's weird when people call me Alpha in, like, friendly contexts. I don't know. I, I think it's a little bizarre. Ruby, Evan, and I grinded out wins for Team Alfred. Fuck yeah, man. That's what I want to see. I don't like saying Alpha because it's parasocial. I mean, I feel like calling me by my first name is a bit more parasocial, no? But uh, whatever you want to do, just realize I don't, I don't really care. What about Mr. Rad? That was not on the list I just gave you. What about Jake, Jakey, Jacob? No, literally none of these things are on the list I just gave you. My two preferences are, are Alpha... Alpha Red, Alpha Red feels formal. Alpha, Alpha Red, Jacob. Jacob, Alpha Red, whatever you want. One of those. I see it, Chet, being funny men and pitching names of other things I might prefer to be called. And they're not on the fucking list! Chat, if you are pitching anything that is not on the list of three names that I just gave you, the answer is fucking no. Chat beach funny chat. Okay, like I understand the joke, but like, let's put it in a different sense. What if I said like, these are the pronouns I like. Would everyone start pitching other pronouns and say, what about this one? What about she, her? Just, just throwing it out there. Just come the fuck on chat. All right, um, here's an easy ban. Someone just said attack helicopter. There we go. That's that's an easy one. Yeah, I didn't have to work for that one. I think one time I was talking about pronouns. And usually when I ban someone, if you just like appeal the ban and you say sorry, you'll probably get unbanned. But it's the people who I have seen... <laughs> So when I was talking about pronouns, just as a concept the other day, someone said, are your pronouns forward slash Ariel? And that is the first ban that I put a note on and I said, never unban this person. They are gone to the shadow realm. Yeah, also... <laughs> Also, chat, I, I think we're kind of missing the point of the joke I just made of, like, would you pitch other pronouns? And the answer should be no, because that'd be ridiculously transphobic to do. So, uh, let's, uh, le let's realize ir irony can only go so far. <laughs> What's the Ford Ariel joke? Let's give it up for the new gen alpha rad viewers. Oh my god. No, you are so welcome here. You don't know about the dark past. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you. No, no, no. It's not a joke at all. You're fine. You're in the right place. Let's give it. I love knowing that people are still coming in. Oh, you, you see him bounce? What, a, what an active guy. It's just a reference to an old video. That's all it really is. It's a reference that I haven't really made in like years, but some people think I still make it, which is crazy. I saw someone on Twitter being like, I used to be an Alfred viewer, but I stopped watching him in like 2022 because all he does is make the Ford Ariel joke. And I was like, Bleh. like, I haven't done that shit in years. I don't know. It's just so crazy. I think my favorite people are just like asking like pronoun questions in chat. I think my favorite thing about people being like transphobic, wait, that's not the that's not the best start to a sentence. But I think my favorite thing is whenever you're trying to convince people to just call people what they're preferred. They'll always say, "Well, if I well, if I don't know what their gender is, what do you want me to call them?" And I think that's hysterical. <laughs> you know, they always say that. They always say that. If you read people's sentence, they will always ask that exact question. It's like they're so close. They, they always say that. <laughs> they always say that. You'll notice because it's just like, then the argument is like, 
oh, well, they and them is like plural. And it's, but then they will just do it in that same sentence. Oh, mwah. it's fucking marvelous. I laugh every single time I see what do you call them. It's like, it writes itself, you know? There are people who are also plural. Yeah, but that's not like, rel like, like that's not the conversation these people are having. Yeah, no, it's funny. It is funny. Yeah, I mean, like, I'll keep it a buck with you. Like, I'll rock he, they like a motherfucker. I get it. I get craving androgyny. That's me. That, that That's who I am. But then, like, with, you know, like, plural and neo-pronouns, like, that's something, like, you know, I don't really get. Like, I don't understand why someone would, would want to go by that. But I think the question, it comes back to who the fuck cares what I think if people are comfortable with it, you know? I think that's like the beauty that people have to understand. Just fucking, dude, I'll call you whatever you want. I think my, uh, my grandfather grew up in Alabama and moved to Oklahoma, okay? So realize, but my grandfather was a kick-ass guy. And you would think he would be one of the most bigoted people you know. And he taught me so much about the world before he passed. Like, that, what an what a incredible man. He told me, like, when... Um, of course, he had some old things that, you know, he kind of worked out. But I remember I asked him once out of curiosity. I was like, how do you feel about gay marriage? And he said, I don't want to get gay married. So I just won't. Which was so based. <laughs> like, dude, what a what a banger response. <laughs> he was just like, yeah, it's not about me. And then uh, I remember this was kind of like um, with the uh, oh my god, wait, what's what's her fucking name? Um. Yeah, with Caitlyn Jenner. I was like, I, I was just forgetting her name. Yeah, uh, this was about the time with the whole Caitlyn Jenner thing was kind of surfacing. I think that's like 20, is like 2016-ish. Um, when it became like a thing, I remember bringing it up to uh, my grandfather because I really wanted like his take on it. It was 2014? Okay. Uh, I was just asking him about it. And he was like, it, it was the same thing. He just said... I don't really want to be transgender, so I just won't. Every social, like, sociopolitical issue for him was boiled down to, I don't want to do that, so I won't. And then just, like, that that was it. That was his whole take. He let, he was just like, anything that is not affecting him is not of his concern. And I just thought that was such an incredible way to view the world. And I think that's just molded how I see everything. It's just like, I, it does not matter to me what you want to be called. If it matters to you, I will just follow it. Young Alfred be asking the career ending questions? No, it's just, I mean, I was already close to my grandfather. I kind of knew where he stood on a lot of political issues. It's just a good take. Yeah, not my business is a good answer. Point crow says taxes. I don't want to do that, so I won't. Yeah, that, that's that's the same thing. <laughs> yeah, no, you're right. No, no, you're right. Um, my grandpa was actually like he did mortgages for a living, and he told me that he made roughly sixty thousand dollars on the side just playing poker at casinos a year, and because of that, he always had his briefcase and kept thirty thousand dollars in cash. So he could go to the casino after work. What a fucking legend. Dude, and then he would wear my merch to the casinos. Dude, like, that dude was the GOAT. Like, I love the fuck out of my grandpa. And it's like, it's sad. It's sad. Like, oh my god. Okay, hold up, hold up. Uh, I, I, he, I was super close to him. And he was just fucking sick, dude. Like, he was so supportive. He was the first family member I ever told about Alpharad. And he was so, like, 
You know, he didn't understand YouTube. He didn't understand like the video games or whatever, but he understood numbers. I showed him um, what Social Blade was. So if you guys don't know, it's like a, it's a, it's a website where you can track, you know, numbers, growth, whatever on Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, YouTube, whatever. I showed him Social Blade and dude, he checked that shit every single morning. Like he would text me to congratulate me on milestones. I didn't even know I hit, you know? Like, I have never had someone support me in that way, especially someone who, like, didn't even understand what the hell he was looking at. Like, I would just be doing well, and he would let me know that he noticed that I was doing well. It was like, I didn't have that in any of my family. None of my fucking family supported me with, like, YouTube early on. But, like, he was the one person who did. I've told this story a lot of the time, but um, when I first started on YouTube, I was juggling a full-time job, 18 hours in college, and trying to do YouTube. So whenever things were starting to take off and he kind of saw like the potential, he wanted me to like focus on it. And so he offered to pay my rent for like a year. And I said, sure. And then uh, like, you know, Alpharad took off, right? So yeah, just a year. He just wanted me to be able to quit my job and just see where it goes, you know? And my rent was like $400 a month. So if he's making a lot of money on the side, like he was fine. Like, keep in mind, this dude never gave me money for anything. Like he was a very, he was very big in like your kids learning how to like earn their own money and stuff. He has never given me money handouts for anything else besides that one thing. And yeah, no, it was incredible. So I, I, I didn't quit my job. I went to more part-time work and Eventually, I did quit my job, obviously, because, uh, yeah, it was his investment. Yeah, that's how he saw it. And so he pretty much just paid me 400 bucks a month to just focus on YouTube. And, of course, 400 bucks wasn't enough to live off of, so I still had to keep my job part-time. So I could, like, at least pay for groceries and, you know, stuff like that. And gas, right? Where were you when you were renting $400 a month? Uh, I had a two-bedroom apartment with my friend in uh, Oklahoma. When did you decide to go full-time on YouTube? Uh, probably when I was making like a thousand, two thousand dollars a month. But like at the time I was still scared, right? Because that's good money to live off of, but I, it didn't sound secure to me. Like I didn't know if that job was gonna be there in like two years, you know? Cause like when you're starting out on YouTube, it feels so fleeting. It's just like, oh, let's enjoy this while it lasts, not knowing if it would turn into anything bigger. So like. Even in my early years of YouTube, I was still very skeptical. Like, um, I always had a backup plan because I was very skeptical. What year is that? Probably like 2014, 15, 16, around that area. And yeah, and then I think like, uh, I think this one's really cute. Uh, whenever I, um, whenever I hit 100K, you know, you get your little YouTube plaques. Oh, Coney, thank you for the raid. I'm I'm talking about real sad shit right now. <laughs> Holy shit. All right, just in time. Fellas, you ever have grandparents who pass away unexpectedly? Yeah, all right. Anyways. <laughs> so, yeah, what we were talking about, uh, my grandfather was the fucking goat because we were talking about, like, uh, social political issues. Uh, and my grandfather, and like, his uh, age 70... Right. And every time I would ask him about issues and be like, hey, how do you feel about like gay marriage? You know, asking uh, Oklahoma Republican uh, grandfather how he feels about gay marriage. And I was like expecting the worst. But his whole philosophy was like, I, I just won't get gay married. I just don't want to do that. So uh, and that's how he was on every issue of just like it doesn't apply to me. Therefore, I that do whatever you want. And I just thought that was sick. And that's kind of how I have my entire viewpoint nowadays. Yeah, no, it's based. It's absolutely based. And then, uh, after that, like, yeah, he still, uh, he still voted for Trump because he was like, eh, he could be, a, I don't agree with any of his shit, but I think he could be a good businessman. So he, he was optimistic and, you know, like, you know, you know, yeah, not less based, but at least it wasn't for like the social issues why he voted for Trump. It was, well, you know, we'll give it to him. Yeah, it's the monkey's paw of the situation. But uh, he invested in me and, like, he told me, like, 
commit to YouTube. He helped me out financially when I was first starting. Um, and yeah, whenever I hit 100K, you get like the silver plaque, you know? Uh, and I thought it was fitting, so I got lunch with my grandfather. You want to get like, no, he got dinner. You want to get like a big steak dinner once I hit 100K, which was really cool, right? And um, I, I never had my silver play button because as soon as I got it, I, I gifted it to my grandfather because I don't know. I felt like he invested in me and I kind of wanted him to have that as like a sentiment. So I, I gave that to him. And what's funny is I never got it back. He passed away a few years later and I don't know where the fuck it is. <laughs> Uh, who knows? But that's not the point of the story. It's my 100k button, plaque button is gone, is all I'm saying. <laughs> um, someone said, will he be on Alpha Red Gold? Okay, so I'm sure you started typing that halfway through that sentence I was just saying. Yeah, maybe he took it with him. Who knows? Um, but what was really cool was his office, because he worked in mortgages, his office was down the street from my college. So usually I had classes on like uh monday wednesday friday so i'd usually get lunch with him before because i had like evening classes so i'd usually get lunch with him and one time after that dinner we had uh i went to his office just to like i picked up lunch and we were going to eat it at his office and i realized that like behind his desk he had all these shelves and cabinets and he had my stupid youtuber silver play button like just on display and i was like you have so many clients who have no fucking clue what that is or question it or think he's a youtuber now you know like all kids are gonna come in there and be like why the fuck is he a youtuber but no it's really cute it's it's super cute and probably like one of the most influential people to uh, ever grace my life no phenomenal guy yeah it's like it's a real shame because i my dad and i talk about it a lot it's just like alpha rad has evolved so much since when he passed in like uh, 2017. To uh, put this one into perspective in a really funny way, the last video I uploaded, uh, I found out he passed the day after I uploaded it, was was uh, Ernie Gang, uh, the VR chat video. So like that was, that was the last Alfred video he saw, fortunately. Yeah, like that's, that's the timing. Um, yeah, that one. That was like six years ago. Yeah, it was a long ago. Um, but yeah, yeah. A lot of people forgot about it. It was just like a memory pulled out from the depths. Yeah, it feels ancient. Yeah, it was a long time ago. But yeah, I wish he got to see it now. Because I don't... I think that means he never even got to see like... Yeah, no. He never saw a million subs, you know? He never got to see the channel hit a million or two or three, right? It's just like... Or it's also, this is like a personal one, but it really sucks. I think the thing that sucks the most about having like a family member pass is that if you were ever to date anyone, you never get them, you never get a chance for them to meet that person. You know what I mean? Like that's something I always think about and it all, it always, uh, it sucks, right? <laughs> like, I don't know. It, it just sucks. Yeah. Cause it's like, oh, if you ever were to meet someone. It's, yeah, it's not even like a blessing, though. It's just like, I wish my partner could meet how badass of a guy that dude was. Fuck, dude. Oh, this is real. All right. We're talking about fun things now. All right. Yeah, what a great sounding dude. Yeah, great fucking dude. Anyways, uh, Pokemon. Am I right? Pokemon, huh? Let's find this silly fucking Caterpie. Not the shiny Weedle. Not the shiny Weedle. It's okay to get an emotional alpha? No, it's fucking not. <laughs> not on stream. <laughs> no, it's not. Let me be emotional in my own time. <sighs> now we're all good. Hi, Kakuna. That, that is incorrect. Yeah, not when it can be clipped. Dude... I have cried on stream once, and I saw it taken out of context multiple times. And I was like, never again will I cry on stream. 
Dude, I cried on stream because I, I think in like 2018, I, again, like a year after my grandfather passed, uh, Panda Global, you know, rest in peace, <laughs> did a uh, cancer charity stream. My grandpa passed due to cancer. Very sensitive spot. And uh, I did the thing and I, I wanted to like kind of give a testimony about uh, how much cancer sucks. And I did that and started fucking bawling on accident. So uh, then I saw the next day a screenshot of me crying with the caption, when your Mario forward aerial misses. And I was like, yeah, we're done with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it's funny in concept, but I was like, man, fuck this. <laughs> oh, yeah, fuck this, man. <laughs> oh. It's always the Ford Ariel, man. It's always the Ford Ariel. Alpha, didn't your Ernie Gang video destroy VR chat? I don't know. <laughs> I don't really think it did, but I, I guess I don't really know for certain. Yeah, that'd be funny if you weren't crying about fucking cancer. It's just like the most extreme thing you could be crying over, and it's just, let's make a fucking Smash Bros. meme. It's just, I think Smash fans, yo, Kony viewers, you agree to this, are the most point, like, Smash reference, you get it? Smash? You know? <laughs> it's, it's just, you get it, Smash Bros, right? Laugh, it's Smash Bros. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yep. True. True. Yeah. I, I see the Coney viewers in the chat. I can. I can tell them apart. Ugh. Yeah. It's the, it's the should have tacked right. Like I think that's the funniest one. I think. The community is at better at large with it nowadays because people have started clowning on him. But I remember top players talking about how they got in car accidents and people would be like, should detect. You know, just should detect. <laughs> yeah, get it? It's just fucking... I remember one time I saw Nakat, a Ness main, talk about like systemic racism and then with like cops that they experienced and then like a... Someone just said, should have missed back throwing the cop if they approached you. And I'm like, Phew. like some of those are just like embedded in my head. Bro, it was, <laughs> it's crazy. It's crazy what people will do. <laughs> it's crazy. Most empathetic Smash player, but true though. <laughs> but actually true. No, 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 guys. Nakat wasn't the one who said that. Nakat was the one who had it said to them. Yeah. It's crazy. I'd be heated. I don't think I'd be mad. I would just be like eyes wide. What the fuck? It's like the same energy when you... Did you watch the Linus Tech Tips stream when he talked about how he casually says the hard R? Did you? That was like... I was just like eyes wide. And for context, he learned later in that stream... No, 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 no. He said he what? Linus thought hard R meant... Like, the R slur. Like, it, it's a hard word to use, and it starts with the letter R. You know, for, like, mentally challenged, that slur. Yeah. So he was just talking. He was like, dude, I was watching American Dad, and they just say the hard R. And the guy's like, whoa, that's crazy. He's like, yeah, I mean, I know. I used to say it. And then they are like, N no, whoa, whoa. Can we clarify what that means? And then he explained that it was a misunderstanding. Yeah, he was like, I used it as a kid several times. It was like, I saw it with like eyes wide, like, uh-oh. You know, everyone who was in that production set was probably thinking, I'm out of a job. I'm out of a job, they think. That, that he just said this. People were probably looking around with their mile yards, mile long stares. Yeah, <laughs> it's fucking, uh... Yeah, it was like the longest 30 seconds you've ever seen. How far in the count are we for Caterpies? Let's see. Let's see. Uh, 
150. Okay, halfway to the prediction. Um, yeah, we'll use more. Also, Toxiquid. I, I was mid-story, so I didn't read off your five gifted. But thank you for the five gifted. Like, thank you a lot. We are, uh, 8.2, almost 8.3k. Because, chat, for anyone who just tuned in, I am shilling much more than normal. Because, if you know, if you get 10k subs on Twitch at any point in time... Uh, you just get that, you get max emotes forever. You, you get infinite emotes, essentially. And if you drop down to seven subs after that, you still get max emotes. So I just want that. So we can get it once, and then I never will shill again. But thank you, Saints, for the two gifted Fridge Viking for the tier one. Um, and I just want anyone to check to see if they have any primes. And if so, I will gift you with 60 emotes. And I said, there's a lot of other things you might get if we hit 10k. If we hit 8.5k, uh, I'm about to react to my first Let's Play ever recorded, and I'm a little scared. I want Now that we're talking about it, I hope the language is okay, given the time. We'll see. I'm sure it's fine. Uh, it's fine. No, I know it's fine. Chat, I'm joking. I know it's fine. But thank you for all the Prime subs. Are we about to hit 8.3? Oh my god, we hit 8.3. I think he would say fuck. Do you... I wonder if I even, like... I wonder if I even curse in that video is what I'm wondering. I wonder if I was even cursing. Like, obviously off-camera, but I don't know if I was trying to be, like, PG. Is it the first Alpharad? Oh, it's the... It's the first Alpha Red video. Hayden, I'm sure you remember the, the original Pokemon Sapphire playthrough. That I'm going to be reacting to that at 8.5k. Does Lysol always also make your emotes? Bro, there are more emote artists than Lysol on the fucking internet. No, she did not. <laughs> Toasty, show yourself. Present yourself. Yeah, there she is. She has been summoned. What is this? I appreciate um, that you use grinding as part of the run to create content. So many people usually do is skip off camera. I mean, I just view grinding as like I'm talking to chat, you know? I think it's pretty hard to talk to chat and uh, do these runs because I'm usually always focusing on the gameplay. So it's nice to just not, you know? <laughs> Can we get some Alfred W's just because I like them? Oh, and 10 gifted subs apparently. Goddamn. Okay. Thank you, indy for johns for the 10. And then we got... Soon you behind with one tier one. And Guru Room, thank you for the three months said thanks for all the awesome content. You're welcome. I'll try to make more. Um I will make a lot more content if we get a goddamn shiny caterpie. Also, Firus, um I, I have an idea. If if you're down, um I wanna play after I find the shiny goddamn caterpie. I was thinking about how I want to do this. I want to play Omega Strikers with a two stack. And we rotate in a chatter. And if we win, we keep them in the team. And if they lose, they get banned. And we kick them off the team. Yo, Sly Guy, also thank you for the five gifted. How do you, what do you think, Virus? Yeah, so you, you're running for your ban. Ban wait, someone said wait, banned? It'd be funny. It's be it's funnier to put some stakes on it. Banned wasn't the agreement? Oh, but it is now. Not worth the ban? They don't lose. Forehead? Okay, how about this? You only get banned if you lose your first game. If you go one and one in games, you won't get banned. It's only if you lose your first game. How about that? That's fair. 
There we go. Okay, compromise, shake, shake. Got it. Timeout instead of ban? <laughs> yeah, okay. You get timed out for 10 minutes. Yeah, okay, buddy. Yeah, let's just go sit in the corner. Perma band or temp band? Um, how about you just appeal it, and whenever we remember to go through appeals, you just get unbanned. I'll time you out for 365 days. Yeah, okay, no, 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 yeah, we can do that. Yeah, about, you just get timed out for, yeah, a year's fair. Yeah, you can get timed out for a year. Oh, oh, no, no, I like that. Yeah, if you lose, you just get timed out for a year. Oh, the longest timeout is 14 days? Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we'll do 14 days, that's fair. If you lose, it's 14 days. If we go 0-3, then you get banned. How about that? You get banned if you, we go 0-3. I think that's more than fair. Okay, we found the perfect system. We went from a year to two weeks real quick. I mean, that was the max. <laughs> I thought you could do a year. Yes, yeah, shake? Shake's all around. Good to know. VIP if they win. Okay, calm down, buddy. <laughs> calm down. <laughs> nice try. Did you know you can only have 100 VIPs? Yeah, so it's like a it's a limited currency. When's the shaky mode? It's on the list. It'll get done eventually. When are you ending? When you find Caterpie, hit 8.5k. Um, if I get 8.5k, I will stop what I'm doing and watch the video. But then I will probably go back to what I'm I was doing before, be it uh, shiny hunting or Mega Strikers. The stream today is I, I want to do this and then stream Mega Strikers for a little bit. Hear me out, VIP after 10 wins. That's, that is a lot. Uh, I don't, and I, I don't know, I, I think we're at the low ranks too. So like, I think someone good could just do that. So, uh, no, 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 there's no shake, no shake chat. Highest win streak is VIP. Um, if I did like a full Omega Striker stream, then sure, maybe. But like, you realize that whoever gets in earlier has an easier chance of getting that because then the, the longer we go, the higher the ranks are. Oh, oh, oh. Got so many fucking Caterpies. I am still livid over the fact we found a shiny and it was just incorrect. It was just wrong. Hey, just joined in. Why are we catching a bunch of Caterpies? Just be cool. Just be cool about it. Okay. Okay. We just want to see him. Because it's funny. Exactly. 169 subs till 8.5k hit. Oh, shit. Oh, that's close. Wait. Oh, yeah. No, that's correct. Yeah. Math goes crazy, doesn't it? Because Caterpie is awesome. Yeah. So add this current number plus like... What did the last one end on? Like 86? Like it was a lot of Caterpies. Yo, Hobo in the corner. Oh, wait, wait. So, oh, I didn't know it says that. They got a gift sub from Jane Animations. Oh, that's cool that it tells you that. And now they're gifting five subs. Oh, that's awesome. I, I didn't know it like, gave you that information. But thank you. That's cool. Yeah, it's like a pay it forward kind of deal. Yeah, this is... Uh, the reason I'm shilling so hard is because this is the highest sub count we have ever had. So now let's just see how high it can fucking go. Um, and tomorrow, uh, for Coney viewers still around from the raid, or just Coney viewers, tomorrow night, Coney and I are doing a stream together. Uh, we are going to be long play through Chicken Little on the GameCube. 
I didn't tell you guys what the game was, but Coney did, so I'll tell you. We are going to play through Chicken Little in a speedrun race. Neither of us have any idea what the game looks like. And whoever beats the game first, win. How long to beat says it's about a four-hour experience, but we're going to try and go as fast as we can. So uh, we'll see how Chicken Little goes. It's it's gonna be it's gonna be a run of all time. Is that still a speed run? It's a blind speed run. I, I think blind speed running is pretty fucking funny. Like we're expecting like four to six hours. Like that's how long we're willing to spend on it. We did see the speedrun. Ninpok, thank you for the six gifted, by the way. Uh, the speedrun was uh, like an hour and a half. So I was like, we're obviously not going to hit that. But I think if we could hit like full five hours, we're happy. How do you know if you have a sub? Uh, you should have a little pixel, a little art behind, next to your name. Also, again, Ninpok thing. I was mid-conversation, but thank you, 69 teeth. Oh, I missed that one. Uh... Hobo in the corner and in Paul. All for the... F no, no, no. Thank you, Hobo in the corner. 69 teeth with five gifted subs. Shout out Ninpalk for the six gifted. Huge difference. Massive even. Mm. Where the fuck is Shiny Caterpie? Oh, bro. They dipped. How often are streams? I would say I stream on average like... It's a range. But I would say like three to five times a week. Uh, there aren't, sometimes, sometimes zero, uh, but never like one or two. It's definitely three to five or I'm busy, <laughs> but, and there's no schedule. There's no schedule. Uh, if you're in, uh, just the alpha rad discord, which you can exclamation mark discord, you can get, and sometimes I'll just go live and I will ping everybody in there. Oh, user two, eight, three, three, huge seven gifted subs. Yo, we're one-upping Ninpalk. That's crazy. The reason that I that I why I take breaks uh, from streaming is because I record so much, and then I have to take like a couple days off to turn that into videos. So, because uh, YouTube's like the main hustle, right? So, uh, streaming is I just kind of see it as like a, a monetized recording session, but at the same time. Before I was streaming, right? Oh, Ninpok with a nine gifted. Holy shit! One up, two up to me even. Uh, but yeah, before I would stream regularly, uh, I would not record regularly. Having a responsibility of stream really motivates you to actually finish these fucking video ideas you start. If anyone kind of feels like I can never commit to recording or something, just try streaming it. Even if you have like one or two people who want to watch it. Like, it'll motivate you to actually finish the thing you want to do. Ugh. How are you liking Xenoblade DLC? Uh, I, I've been kind of busy lately, so I haven't really gotten into it. I'm probably like five, six hours through it. I've been popping off around every corner. Literally peak, peak experience. Oh my god. Uh, what is that? Enjoy Lake? Is that, is that what it says? Ten gifted. Okay, so I think you're one-upping the nine. No, no, ten's fine, I thought about it. Yeah, we can go ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, ten's the, the better number to come after nine. Thank you for the ten gifted. You know, it's, it's a very memorable number. Yeah, yeah, no, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> now can we get eleven? <laughs> I like how we're just going up in intervals. Thank you. Thank you, chat. Uh... I, I don't even want you guys to waste your money at this point. We're pretty close. Just check to see if you have a prime before these fucking idiot motherfuckers just give all this money they don't need to. <laughs> Someone says, why not up it to 100? <laughs> yeah, yeah, no one's going to top that. All right. <laughs> also, Corey, uh, I know you just like kind of... You just kind of like pop in and you have mod, but we have a mod Discord if you ever want to want to pop in. Uh, M rats for for the other mods who are wondering who I'm talking to. Yeah, ones who skip a few. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Skelly with the the tier one. Hell yeah. 
<laughs> oh, Alejo. See, that's what I want. I just want. Uh, um, no, that's just all I want. I, I, I don't. I don't want the people to burn their wallets, even as a bit. I, I would rather just take money from Amazon. Because that one's funnier. <laughs> How many hours do you think it's going to be to get five shiny Pokemon? Ooh, or 50 shiny Pokemon. That's a good, good-ass question. So we are currently at 44 hours. Um, I, I think we're going to go faster than double. Because for the first 12 hours, I that was spent on one Pokemon. Because I didn't really know what the fuck I was doing. So... Uh, I think that's like the big difference is I actually know how to shiny hunt in this game. I figured it out. We have lures, which we didn't initially. Um, I I would my guess I'm gonna say. Um, I'm gonna say we're gonna get to Koga, at like 80 to 90 hours. And that might be a little optimistic. Like 80 to 100. Can I give a 20 hour range? Yeah, I'll say 80 to 100 is when we're going to get to Koga. So the final run might be like 100. 150? Yeah, that's fair. It just really depends on the luck, right? Because we could have miserable luck and be here for like tens and tens of hours. Yeah, when we get to Koga, uh, it's over. Like, when we get to Koga, we finish the game in like a few hours, you know? So that's really where we're at. We just gotta get to Koga. Can't wait to see this video next year. Uh, this is a December video for damn good reason, too. Alpha, you missed a shiny? Bro, no, you can't say that in this chat. That is the most evil thing you can say. It's cruel, even. Huh. <sighs> Where is the Caterpies? Ugh, so many little guys, but not the little guy we're looking for. There's Bulbasaur. He could have been shiny. We would have accepted shiny Bulbasaur. Uh, not Bird. We already have shiny Bird. Um. Oh, some <laughs> flesh-eating cow. Thank you for the Prime sub. Oh, holy shit. Thanks. Yeah. Uh... How do I just summon him? Is it possible for me to just summon the guy through, like, I don't know, like a sacrilegious ritual or something like that? Is there anything I can do? There's so many guys, and none of them are shiny. I feel like if I just wait here, a shiny could pop up. If I could be patient, see? they're all, None of them are really moving. Bulbasaur is, but he's okay. It would be crazy for me to just, like, find a spot where I can just AFK, and then someone would just tell me when they find a shiny, and it would be terrifying. Yeah, maybe if I stand right here, I can look at both patches of grass. This one might not be the uh, worst idea. Pidgey could come over. This is just... Like, this is probably possible, and I could sacri- Like, I could- I could manage it, but it just sounds way less fun. The odds only work on one Pokemon per refresh, I understand, but there- it's, The odds are still way lowered. Um, than, like- Like, full odds. Camera is in the way of the grass. Chat, it's okay. It is okay, chat. Also, the prediction. Yeah, I guess that does kind of fuck over the prediction, huh? Because then it guarantees. Um, 176. Got it. Uh, there's just so many. I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave this area. There's too many guys. Um, remember when we found a sh golden worm shiny and I thought it was Caterpie so I caught it without thinking and it was fucking Weedle? That was a good one. Got 
Hi, Pikachu, with your anime voice. Hi, Kakuna, with your voice. I just want to take a little glance around. What if Shiny Metapod... If it's Shiny Metapod, we take it. It's not ideal, but we will accept a Shiny Metapod. I'm glad they took back the anime Pikachu voice. Honestly, me too. Um... He could just spawn in here, though. Alright, I'm gonna take him. The next one will be shiny. I... I don't believe you. It's a pretty insane call to say that the next one's gonna be shiny in confidence. It's not impossible, per se. But it doesn't sound realistic. Personally, I think it's gonna be like more like 213, you know? I don't know. And the next Caterpie is a friend. A normal friend. It's tiny. I mean, look. I think it's fine if Caterpie is over odds. Because we had like four or five Pokemon in a row that was like phenomenally under odds. It's tiny, though. This is the point, like, that one stream we had when we got three shinies in one day, that was just straight serotonin. But now, it's kind of like, oh, yeah. This is my numbing. Oh, I forgot. You know, you just kind of forget sometimes. Change the color and it will be shiny. Can I... How can... Let, let me see what I can do here. Um, we, we could just kind of like try to make it like a little more gold, you know? Oh, that didn't really work. Um, okay, I think I... I think I overdid it. Um... There we go. I did it. Uh, I'll just turn that off now. <laughs> yeah, he's a little, little piss boy breaking bad filter. <laughs> yeah. Oh. No Weedle. Do not even think about turning shiny. Uh, I just want a Caterpie to spawn and go boom. Shiny. Within the next 20 encounters. It will... Wait, wait, wait. Within the next 20 encounters, says Daroke, it will be shiny. I bet a two-week ban on it. Okay. 20 encounters. Starting now. Chat, count them. Here is one. I think it's funny that they didn't even say I get something if I win. Direct, okay. This benefits me, but it also benefits chat. Uh, if 20 encounters for 20 subs. If we do get it in the next 20 encounters, I'll gift all the chat and you are the hero for the entire village. I'll, do, I'll even give you 21. Because uh, we are now 20 away from the prediction too. Yeah, the, the gambler. You will... Wait, I need to go find find this message. Um wait a sec. Let me let me try and find it. Uh I'm trying to pin the comment. I'm trying to find it. Oh, can I can I not pin it? Oh, that sucks. Oh, they found it. Nice, nice. Thank you, Suiku. I could not find the chatter. Alright. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so there's the first one. The first one didn't count, because I'm want it to be on an even twenty. Okay, I'm going to go to this other patch of grass. I'm going to stay right here for the entire time. 
Yeah, so it's just one. As soon as we get to 200, it's over. The dream's dead at 200 with the prediction. You, chat, we don't need to count anymore. It's just when we get to 200, the bet's off. I looked up with a catch combo. It's 1 in 341. But I think if you have a lure, I think it's like 1 in 313. I think that's the odds. We can still count, though. You can. Yeah. I guess you're all invested in this one, right? Uh, you got your hero on the line. Does it have to be Caterpie for the bet? Hmm. I'm... Wait... Did they say? No, they said the next one will be shiny. They did not say shiny Caterpie. Okay. If we get a shiny Caterpie, Metapod, or Bellsprout, or Bulbasaur, I will allow it. If it's Weedle, it does not count. If it's Pidgey, it does not count. Uh, if it's Weedle, again, it also does not count. What if Pikachu? Oh, yeah, yeah, Pikachu. Yeah, yeah. Anything that counts towards the... Anything that counts towards the decks. So, uh, chat, I feel like I've been gifting way too many subs lately. I feel like I've just been losing a lot. Losing a lot of bets I've been making with chat. Okay, so I say we still hunt Caterpie, but uh, we'll move this one over here. I think it's only fitting that we name this after Daroke. It's a, it's a technicality because since we're not evolving Throat Goat, we get this to evolve into Victory Bell. Wait, did I spell it? Oh, it's De Roach. Oh, it's De Roach. I was saying De Roach. It's, I see De Roach now. Did I, did I spell it wrong? Oh, yeah, it's De Roach. I see now. Okay. And now we go back to hunting Caterpie. Woohoo. Whatever. He has earned VIP chat. We cannot give VIP out to everyone. I I was doing that until I realized there was a finite amount. Yeah, I'll, I need to put this bell sprite in my party, though. Um, add to party. Replace a Pidgeot. We're about to get the Dragonite that people are not excited for. I, I cannot believe that one. I cannot believe it. 
Changes marking, also true. So today, it doesn't feel like we really did a lot. Because we caught a Pokemon who we can evolve that we already could have done, but are choosing not to. And also caught a Weedle, which is a Pokemon we just already had. So... Whatever, man. <laughs> um... I think, I think, like, four hours is a good amount. I think I might just play Omega Strikers for, like, an hour or so. Um... But dude, what a what a day. I guess I should save, huh? What is a Mega Strikers? Never heard of it? Well, we'll show you. We'll get there and we'll show you. All right, let me uh, get rid of all this. Let me boot this up. Um, I should change it. Um. Team Alpha. We can do it, Team Alpha Red. Uh, and I'll just delete all the shit. Um, oh, is, um, oh, I spelled Omega wrong. Um, Omega Strikers. There we go. So, oh, let me get in call with Virus. Let me. We'll get in call. No, this game is heat. Wait, I want to... I want... Oh, wait. There's this camera. Yeah, I'll keep this camera here. Um, Fires, if you're in chat, I need... Oh, you're in chat. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. You ready to... You ready to strike? Yeah, are you on? I'm just about to go on, yeah. Congrats on the... Uh, which post sprout? Yeah, the one post we sprout. definitely already had. Yeah. I was confused. So I was like, surely that doesn't count, right? But, it does yeah, because no, we're not evolving yeah. the other yeah, one. Yeah, 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 Those yeah. were the rules. Mm hmm. Oh, that's loud. Okay. All right, chat. I need you to. Um... Did you like my skin? Oh no, the boo! The boo! I like he's him. A scary, he's a scary guy. Okay, so so you know the rules. Uh, We're gonna be playing with, with viewers. Mm -hmm. And if we lose, they get timed out for two weeks. If we get three would <laughs> they get banned. Yeah. And if we so win the and on. then lose, they're safe. Okay. Okay. So chat. Um, in the creative versus event, we're doing pretty well. Honestly, we're doing pretty damn well. Yeah, uh, second place is secure. Place, yeah. It's just crazy. Yeah. Um, huge ups. But who had... Chat, let me know what... Okay, so this is what I'm going to ask. In the public server, I am going to open a text chat very briefly, which is something I will soon regret. I'm aware. <laughs> but... I want you guys to post pictures of uh, th this screen right here. It says how many wins you've gotten in support of Team Alpha Red. I want you to post that with your username. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. I think people can type in here. I just opened it up. Can people type? They said you fool. Yeah, I'm not showing the Discord on stream because uh, I know what is going yeah, to happen. Yeah, that would be uh, not a great idea. Yeah. Virus, I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. Do you mind uh, uh, just finding the most wins for me? Gotcha. Yeah, I'll have a look. All right, I'll, I'll be right back. This. Uh, wait, which? Oh, there it is. Omega Strikers. Oh, God. Okay. Um. Oh, there is a lot. By the way, uh, chat, subscribe. Give some subs while we're at it. What What are we at right now? I know, Jacob, uh, what, what was that? 8.4? We're so close to like 8.5. Like 8,500 subs. So like, you know, 
Why not give some more subs? I saw I saw a lot of gifties earlier. 8,410. That's like so that's basically 8,500. We might as well just get that now. Uh let me have a look at Oh my god, there's so <laughs> We've got a bunch of funny men in the chat right now. There's the, I see very little Omega Strikers and uh, a lot of whatever this is. Um, okay, so this person has five wins. This person has eight wins. Uh, what, what is the Dude, this, this, this chat is just about what I expected it to be when he said he was going to open it. This person has 15. They're the current uh, leader. First person has 68 wins. Hold up, actually. That's crazy. I need to uh I'm gonna open this up in a um in my browser real quick. This person has 68. Someone said hi fire, so I didn't see your name, but hello, what's up? This person has 36. Um, okay, five wins, five wins. 38. There's some there's some big hitters here. Okay. 18. Um, okay, let me scroll back down. Uh, take our rights away. I do not have that power. I'm sorry. Oh my god, this person has 30, uh, 28 wins. Or, did you find one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So did you want me to find the most? Cause, yeah, uh, who has the most wins? That, there is a person that has 68 wins. I need to... God, where is where, where did they go? Because as you can imagine, uh, it's very little Omega Strikers in here right now. And yeah, it's, I see a lot else. of Pokemon porn. Yeah, there's a lot of that, which is great to sift through. Yeah, uh, and kind of 68? expected, if I can be yeah, real. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, right. I see 37, wins? but they didn't post their username. Yeah. I needed the picture I'm, attached I'm people... with the username. Yeah, a lot of these people didn't post the username. Yeah, there, a lot of people just posting it. I said, I need your username too. Yeah, where's the guy of 68? Where is he? Guys, you're missing, you're missing the point. You need the username so we can actually like add you to the lobby. Uh, micro, micro Jelly Overlord is the one that adds 68 wins. Okay. But like, and that's their name that's in game? Username. I don't know if that's your username. And now people are posting usernames. Oh, uh, okay. I'll just jump to the beginning then. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Okay. See, 28 from Yoshi Boy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Entertaining In, content. Oh, I thought this would go a lot smoother, if I can be honest. Yeah, no, I can... I thought they would have included, you know, the, uh, the username. Okay, but... this guy has 34 wins. We're just gonna rock for it. Atro... Yeah, okay. It's probably backwards. Let's say Jack... Jack... I don't know. I'm calling them. <laughs> I'm calling them Jack. Got All right, you. we sent a friend request to them. Nice. I see Micro Jelly Overlord typing, but they've been typing for a minute. All right, Can well, through if you're 68 wins, uh, my username is J underscore uh, J hyphen one in game, but I'm going to sleep. Oh, well, that's just why would you? Then, 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 then why? Yeah, what's okay. the point? You're just wasting everyone's time. Okay, I am inviting someone. Okay. okay All right. So we're queuing up competitive, and let's see if we win. And also, anyone, uh, if we get uh, 8.5k subs, I'm stopping what I'm doing and I'm reacting to that silly video. But uh, yeah. also, uh, you can also play alongside us and we can just, just let's, we might not be able to get first place, but let's try to secure second as much as we yeah, possibly exactly. can. Make sure you click on Korea vs. Event Support Team Alpha Rad. Yeah, something I didn't know is that you can use like right click to move in this game with like League of Legends controls. That's what Ruby does, and I like I can't imagine playing like that. Well, it's because you don't I play mean, League. Yeah, 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 exactly. Because I don't play MOBAs, but like, yeah, but I'm, these the guys who made this game yeah. came from League, so I think it's interesting that yeah, it makes, locks your controls based yeah. on what you try to how you try to move first. Mm hmm. Okay. Uh, um, bonus damage. Or st hmm. I'll take stack. Um, who will be banning? Um, they want Amy ban. Honestly, uh, I'm a... Sure, you know what? I'll let them pick. I'll let the... I, I think yeah. that's my thing. I'm always gonna go with what the fan says. Okay. Yeah, that I'm gonna sense. trust. This is a true test to see how they play the game. If they can hold themselves up, yeah. Yeah. The pressure is on. The... I like banning X personally, me? just because we I don't like having... I like yeah. not having to deal with him. 
X and slime unless someone on the team is playing slime. Yeah. Uh, I can play rune or slime. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll, I'll open with rune. Yeah. Why? Is rune... Uh, I, I don't even know which one rune is. Uh, what does he do? Uh, he just summons black holes on anywhere oh, he wants. Black hole guy. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah, I'll play, I'll play slime girl after this. Mm -hmm. Did X get nerfed today? Hell yeah. That's awesome. That would be awesome. He was just pummeling us yesterday. Okay, it's gonna be fun. Yo, huge Dabu. See, let, let, let's see how much our uh, our little friend here does. Mm -hmm. I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna stay up here. Yeah, that's smart. Oh, there we go. Okay, there we go. Doors open. Oh, I missed. Oh my god, that could have been huge. Oh, yeah. Oh, I missed that. I'm gonna go. Oh, oh all you. My goalie, my goat. There we go. There we go. I just want to see them make a. Oh, oh. Okay. Nice. okay. They might not get timed out. They're Keep in mind, chat. The they are the running the risk bit. of getting timed out for two weeks if they lose. Ooh. This is a spooky ghost. Yeah. Oh, it's well, okay. That's fine. Well, you really only need to protect one, is Dubu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm hmm. I'll spread. Okay. They would just want to dr drill me into the wall. That's fine. Oh, damn. I don't love that. I can't believe our, yeah, our teammate would do that. that. Yeah, what the hell? Dude, what what the hell? What, what happened to our teammate? What was their name? What happened? Yeah. Oh, that's that's that, that's me that's right now. Look at that emote. Jack. That's Why me. Why would you do that? That's yeah, me. That's me right now. Uh-oh. Dude, I'm just saying they might get they might get banned. Oh, yo, wait, actually they're cool. A nice emote. I guess that was a pre wreck Oh, that one's all me. That one. Okay, I'll just push up this one. Mm -hmm. I have a wall, so I'll just I'll save that for. Oh yeah, they they conditions. want me bad. Okay. Like that. I guess that was a little redundant. Okay. Oh my god, we need to get this out of here. That's it. Oh, that's I it. Your, uh, what is their W doing? He's just chilling out there. Yeah, he's just yeah, he's just vibing, I guess. Okay. Despite, despite our teammate room. throwing. Yeah, despite the uh. Alfred closed the channel. Oh yeah, I guess so. I should. I was gonna say I have it open on my other monitor, and it's just it's just going up so quickly. Yeah, it is closed now. That is fine. They can have that one. I'll just protect this one. I'll just body block. Um. Okay. Oh no. Yeah, my guy teleports. You see that little the hole guy yeah. right there? Mm -hmm. Um, he just oh, he teleports yeah. to wherever the hole guy is. I see. Got it. Oh. Nice. Nice. Huge. There we go. Oh, I thought I had a big plan there. It's okay. Our teammate's not complete. Oh, oh teammate. Oh, that's, that's bad. Come on, not, teammate. I'm not talking about you. Here? You know that. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Yeah, yeah. You, you've I'm done nothing wrong. Right How could yeah, I'm you? I'm doing my job right here. Yeah, okay. Wait, got it. Nice. There we go. Nicely done. First set. Okay, we did not get 3-0, so they're not getting permaban now. Wonderful. It was close though. I, I I see a world where they did get perma banned. Yeah. No. I thought it was likely even. Mm -hmm. Uh. What do I want? Um. Monumentalist. I like monumentalist. Yeah. Monumentalist is good. Uh. Prime time. I think prime time is also what I would have taken. Mm hmm. Prime time's so good for Dubu because he gets like two logs. Uh. I just get. I guess reduce cooldown. Yeah. I. <laughs> I should have realized. Uh. That opening the chat room allowed people to also type in at everything, at everyone. Yeah, I just saw a couple of pings come through and I was like, oh, okay, yeah. let's discover the. the I just wanted to see if it would work. Well, it did. That's on me. It's honestly, that one is on me. Nice. Hey, mods, can we get a prediction? Can we just, uh, does this person get timed out, yes or no? 
Um, things are looking good, though. Nice. Things are looking good. Actually, no prediction. This is looking free. No prediction. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is just free points for whoever believes. Actually, no, no, do it, do it. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Imaj, you can do the prediction. What's funny is we could just throw at any given moment. We could. Someone we don't like comes up to bat. Okay. Uh huh. Oh, bro, what, where was our teammate? What's happening? Where our goalie our wasn't there, so our teammate yeah. should know that they should yeah, be the goalie. Our teammate should have fallen back when when the goalie was. In yeah, position. when the goalie left the goal, our teammate should have fallen back. <laughs> I, I, I'm we're on the same yeah. page here. Yeah. They should just known that was now their responsibility. Unbelievable, honestly. <laughs> do this. Oh no, I might, I might die here. Oh, nice speed. Okay, nice. This one. Oh wow, they just, I just knocked that one in. Oh, oh, I thought we were just gonna cheese that one in because yeah, they put same. the soup down. Oh, they want me. They want me bad, bro. Oh, damn. Okay. Oh, I was, like oh, I was almost there. Oh, yeah. Dude. Yeah, I can't believe her team. Yeah, dude. Like, come on. Where were you? Is Team Alpha at number two? We are at number two, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. But, uh... Well, I, dude, I just fucking love this game. <laughs> Getting paid to play this game felt like such a goddamn heist. Mm -hmm. It's like I, I just would have, I just wanted just to make content it. on this game for free. Kill, kill. Oh, oh nice. It there. there we go. Okay, now, now it's been even. Oh, okay. Let's go down. Let's go down here. Oh, oh my, my God, our teammate. Damn, dude. Where, where were they? <laughs> Where were they? Where were you? I don't know. They could it's okay. look. It's okay. The sets are even. They're not getting banned. It's okay. Yeah, they're not. Well, if they if we lose, they get timed out for two weeks. Yeah. So there's still pressure. There's still a lot on yeah. the line here. Um. Okay. What do I want? Okay. Built, they I saw that I wanted different. that and took it. No, thank you. I guess built different. Uh, I like I I like aerials. <laughs> the aerials is good. I'm not running Spark like right now, so I'm just gonna do my thing. I don't even know what Sparks like. I, I know you guys were talking about it like yesterday on Cool, but I still don't fully understand. Just the that. the more you have, the stronger you are, pretty much. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Gotcha. Oh, that's fine. Okay, there we go. Okay, got the bomb. Yep. Nice. Did it. Oh. Wow. Smooth. Okay. Nice. Smooth. Okay. Yeah. Inevitable. No oh. Can oh, Cosmic Finger the Five gifted. Oh my God. We are we are piling up. You don't mind if I shill, right? Yeah. No. For, for I'm always course. worried to shill on call if the other person's no, streaming, but I feel like Go it's a courtesy. I, I received the invite and I saw there's two people in here. Oh, here hi, Dylan. Cool. Sorry. We're playing with viewers, and if they if the third, uh, if we lose, they get banned. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> if yeah, if we get three owed, they get hard banned. If we lose, they get timed out for two weeks. The pressure. Yeah, fair yeah, rules. There's a lot of pressure on this. A lot on the line. <laughs> Throw on purpose, get them banned. <laughs> True, we were talking about that. Oh, I tried to be real annoying with that. Oh. Dude, this dude, what are they doing? <laughs> they're, they're best. That's true. That's true, and I, I respect them for it. Oh, anonymous gifter. Not, not a user named anonymous, by the way. Just a person named anonymous gifter. Uh, mm -hmm. Gifted ten fives and left. There's no way cost a lot. Yeah, you take that. Yeah, I'm, I'm taking it. Just so Dubu, Dubu can't. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, I'll leave y'all to it then. All right, goodbye, Dylan. Finish. I'm down to play goodbye, later, Dylan. though. Okay. Bye-bye.
when fish. I was playing with Dylan, he was he he got good at the game pretty fast, as you'd expect from yeah, I, yeah, Dylan that makes nature. Sense. But uh, that he found a character sense. that played like a League of Legends character, and then the game made sense to him. Because <laughs> Estelle plays like Ezreal, and then it mm -hmm. just all made sense. Yeah, yeah, I was playing for a while last night. Watch this? Um, oh, okay. I've, I've got soup ready, so... I thought they would just go down eventually. Like slow? Oh my god, phenomenal. Oh, goodness. Slightly out of position. Oh, and there we go. Nice. Good job, Jack. You don't get banned. It doesn't look Let's like. Let's go, Jack. I like that my wool becomes pumpkins. Yeah, and with your debu. Yeah. Oh my god, what, what, is, what is that goalie doing? What are you doing? It does not matter. We, we take the win. We are in literally bottom competitive elo, you know? Yeah, it's just funny though. Oh, oh. I thought they were. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, big man. You got it. Oh, they. Uh, fitting. <laughs> fitting that they got it. And now we're on, uh, on match point. He does not get timed out, but I think we kind of want to get it so, like, more people play with us, right? Yeah. I, I think we just. We vote. Oh well, put up a poll, Moz. Can, uh, do we keep them in or do we rotate someone out? <laughs> I think they just get kicked out by default, right? Right. Yeah, yeah, GG's. Everyone say GG's. <laughs> Still, it's oh, did you die? Yeah, a little bit. Oh. All right. <laughs> nice. I told you we'd make it. Let's go, Jack. You're not getting banned, it looks like. Congratulations. So happy for you. Why was I pinged on Discord? Thank you for coming. I've gained viewers because people are saying, why the fuck was I pinged? But uh, <laughs> it was not me. I, I made a slight mistake, a lapse of judgment. Mm hmm. All right. I think I, think I will. Uh... I just realized something. This is a. Uh... Let me go window capture on this. Yeah. Oh, and there goes everything. Um, it's still there. Oh um, yeah. And then uh, people people say rotate out. People want to rotate out. Okay, so Jack, good <laughs> job. You got to play on stream and you did not get banned. Uh, I guess I have to leave the group. There's no way to, like kick people. Yeah. Um, um, if you go into the, uh, if you press the little friends list button on the top left, when you're in a group, you can press X on people. Oh. Where it says in group. Okay, well, I'm just going to yeah. invite you back. Um, gotcha. Okay, so Jack, you, you good job. Uh, what rank am I? I just started playing competitive like last night. So, uh, chat, just, yeah, just I'm just going to believe you. Post your uh, username. And can you can fire some of dummy main. Shut up. <laughs> just so post your close. username and your wins for Team Alpharad. Just just post that, and I'm just gonna believe you. Yo, we got Worm GF that said 22 wins, one loss. I wasn't even asking for loss. Is Blue Stacks viable for this? I don't think so. Okay, I'll trust Worm GF. We'll try it. Mm hmm. I will pick so. All right, Worm GF, join the crew. Group? Group has players who are far from each other. Network performance may suffer. That is a good sign. <laughs> yeah. We, we have... Impressive that we haven't seen that, and I'm across an ocean. Oh, wait, what you. the fuck? Wait, why am I... You guys can't see what I'm doing. Why is it... It's frozen. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, wait, I, I, think, I, I think I know. Here. Okay, now we're good. Yeah, this says group has players who are far from each other. Network performance may suffer. Oh, they say we're an. I'm an Aussie. We got this. Okay. okay perfect. Okay, chat. Uh, put up the the prediction now that we know that they are on the other side of the world. <laughs> yeah, literal oh, global oh, team. <laughs> You're right. Uh, Fires is playing from the UK. Yes, sir. It is five in the morning. Perfect time to strike. 
dude, crazy that we're... Seven, 638, right? Yes. No, no, no. That, oh, that's from 9K. Oh, shit. We're only 68 away from watching the cringy first Let's Play. Oh, hell yeah. Fires and I were friends there. He remembers it. I do. I watched the video when it was uploaded. Yeah, isn't that crazy? Okay, so they play mm -hmm. X, um, which is okay. fine. Uh, I personally which would ban, ban X. X. No. Yeah, we should ban... No, <laughs> I'm going to listen to them. What do they? What does WormGF wants to ban? Who do you want to ban? Uh, they want to ban X. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, all right. Okay, so X is now banned. <laughs> okay. Things, things are looking good. Uh, I'm going to play Juno this time. Okay. I'm sticking <laughs> with my hamster friend. Put me in the arena. I'm ready. Okay, they also got Dubu. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna take this. Who's Estelle? What, what is, is uh, that That's Ezreal from League of Legends. Legends. It's just a gotcha. little sniper with a teleport. Win. Uh, the sniper character, gotcha. She is Jacob Cote as hell. I love her design. Mm-hmm, she's good. A lot of the designs in this are really good. Yeah. I can't believe they have Trigger, like, uh, do an animated opening for this. It's yeah, crazy. no, that's sick. Real okay, shit show going on one. here. Oh, okay. Uh, I can't believe good. her teammate dropped that. Yeah. Dude, I'll pick up the slack. There we go. Okay. Oh my god! Okay, Last Worm GF, time. yo! In, worm Alpharad GF. International? We got this? With our global team? <laughs> <laughs> they doubt us because of our ping. It just makes us stronger. <laughs> it makes them weaker, for sure. Exactly. Uh -oh. This is not good. Uh. Okay, I'm oh, gonna like go over here. Oh, that's yours. Okay. Yeah, they don't have Juno. Oh, that might hit. That might hit. That was weird. Okay, I guess we're going back over here. All right. There we go. Now it's even. Beautiful. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you're doing great back there, man. <laughs> Thanks. This is, I'm already in a top five team, but good luck. I mean, I mean, put your money where your mouth is. Okay. We could still throw. We could definitely still lose with you on our team. It's possible. Yeah, for sure. Oh, See, my point exactly. Just another runway to me. Bro, that okay. slime was a paid actor. You see that shit? <laughs> okay, we don't we don't talk about this one. I'm getting off the camera. Fires, oh, listen, man, it happens, it happens. Have I tried Junior as goalie? Uh, I haven't, but I've seen it, and I, I think it's pretty cool. Oh my god, immediately. Yeah, I'm just gonna hold back. Gonna... Okay, they, they can punch me if they want. Okay, we're down here. Oh, wow, we snuck through. Yeah, I'm just kinda... Nope. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, dude, how could our teammate let this one happen? Yeah, what the hell? We're up 2-0. Worm GF, Worm GF, what is going on? The, the pressure is on Worm GF. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's correct. Let's hit it up. Oh, I like their play. I was going to put this down here. Oh, kind of bad. Oh, actually, no. There we go. The there we go. Oh, don't like that. Don't like that at all. Yeah, I'm not a fan of oh, this. Where, where the fuck? Okay. Didn't even know where the pool went for a second. Yeah, I, same thing happened to me. Okay, that's fine. That's perfect. Okay, now we can go down here. Uh, depending on what our teammate wants to do, of course. Alright, teammate dub. Wait. Oh my god, slow and steady, man. <laughs> Huge! Okay. So they're not getting hard banned. We did not get 3-0. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I think me having the check mark is so cringe. It's mm -hmm. why I have that username. Yeah, no, I feel like it like puts a target on your it, back. Like, remember in Fall Guys when we would see TTV in someone's username? Yeah, and we would just bully them. Yeah, we would bully them immediately. Yeah, exactly. Um, 
And we got the royalty here. free banger coming through. Yeah, I was gonna say, this sounds like every vlog in like 2015. This is the Dubu theme, by the way. <laughs> That's so awesome. <laughs> I thought you might like it more <laughs> if I told you. Is this game free? Yeah, it is. And you can win points for us, and then if uh, we get top three, I get a custom skin in the game. Okay, wasted the soup a little bit, but it's okay. Okay, oh, the, the slimes are just confused, man. Yeah. They didn't know what to do. How could Worm GF let me die like that? Worm GF, what happened? Where's my friend? I'll be back. I'll, I'll be back eventually. Where's Luna? Okay. I'm getting a little bit scared there. Oh, oh. Oh my goodness, what is happening? Okay, I was getting real punched. I was getting punched real good. I'm gonna... I'm gonna just go... Yeah, yeah this is fine. This is not... Dubu, can I borrow this real quick? Thank you. Oh, I... I can't believe our teammate just did that. Our, te our teammate knocked it into the goal so that I would miss it purposely. That's just, I can't believe just our teammate up. did that. I can't believe. I can't believe I, No, I, I personally cannot believe our teammate I'm, did that. I'm really upset by this uh, information. Like, I was trying to position the slime without hitting it, and I uh, it just... A little, a little bit of a miscount. Like that. See how it worked out. Okay. Jesus. Chill. Oh my God. Our teammate, no. <laughs> our teammate, what are you doing? I, I can't believe our teammate would do such a thing. Uh, Worm GF, come on, put it together, man. Bro. <laughs> As they're the only person who has not scored on their own team. <laughs> Oh, okay, so we got something here. Oh, wow. I should stand away from there. Okay. Oh. oh, that's good. Love to see that. Good on our our teammates to see that our goalie wasn't in goal and decided to move. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's a good reposition. Oh my god, what happened there? Bob GF. Yeah, they should just bully the check mark, though, I agree. Mm-hmm. Someone give Worm GF a sub no, before they get banned. No, it, it couldn't be me. Uh, dude, I'm not getting Timeless Creator. I'm not getting all, any These are all really good, though. I, I might get one of them. Oh, yeah. There's like three here that are good for creations. Yeah. Timeless Creator preferred. Uh, you want Timeless I'm Creator? It's get... pretty good for you. Uh, I thought Monumentalist would be good, right? Because they make my, uh, my soup bigger? Yeah. Yeah, I just like last longer. I mean, you could. Just, I mean, timeless creator because they size and duration. Oh shoot, it is size. Yeah, 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 right. Yeah, it's okay. I just get some big ass slimes now. Yeah. All right, I just missed that. Okay, and we're going down. Oh. Okay. There you go. It's gone. And they stopped it. I tried to hit it. I tried. Dude, Juliet, fucking chill. Chill. Fucking hit it. Hit it up. I'm ready. Yo, my slime. The fucking clutch. Let's go. Okay. Oh, let's go down, buddy. Let's go. Why do you hit it back at them? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why would Worm GF let you do that? Why would Worm GF let me hit it back? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. They, they should have been there to block it. Yeah. All right. All right. No, you're right. You're right. I just want the slimes to be obnoxious. Oh, okay. Love that one. Okay. Nice. Oh, I thought they were going to try and hit it up there. I was ready for it. Okay, slime's a little confused. Oh, but they're mixing them up. The oh my god, dude, I had it. I was in like the perfect position for that one, and then they just they just boomed me. Okay, yeah. yeah. If you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of what I see. No, I mean we can pull through. 
Who knows? It's, it's, they, they might not get banned. Or even timed out, even. Yeah. Someone said, I feel bad for Worm GF, but I suppose they signed up for it. Yeah, exactly. Oh. It's it's because it's okay. funny because they can lose from reasons that are entirely not theirs. Hence me being dead right now. Nice. Good. Oh my God, their Dubu oh is is not better than yeah. ours. Just you know. Yeah. He, 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 of course he's not. What do you mean? It. And also another to be fair, they did they did let us ban their main. That is, that, is <laughs> that, that is also true. <laughs> I forgot about that. That's awesome. Right. I put that there be annoying. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, okay. I, I tried. Oh my god, where the fuck? Just, sometimes you just lose it. Yeah, no, for real. Okay, that, that would have been nice if I didn't have a Juliet punch on oh, me. Oh, that would have been nice if... Mm. Alright. Alright. No, guys, we can still win this. Here's how no, I believe. Worm GF can still win. Um, um, okay. I think I'll just take peak performance, a perfect form. Uh, I'm gonna take... I'll just take Empower Special. A lot of people believe in Worm GF. They do. Despite them scoring on our own team twice last game. Yeah, which is crazy. Yeah, which is crazy that they would have that happen. Yeah, I can't believe that that's a thing that they would do. But willingly, too. There's so much pressure. Someone said I was against Worm. I hope you throw. <laughs> Thank you. I guess not everyone are believers, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. Whoa, that's, that's crazy. <laughs> What the hell? Um, I guess I'll play goalie for a little bit. Yeah, just stole, I guess. Yep, alright, I'm doing great. I'm Good job. Oh, oh, lovely, lovely. Oh my god. I can't believe they're the reason they scored on our goalie. Yeah. Kinda insane. So maybe they'll pick it up. Maybe we just shouldn't have banned their main. Yeah, <laughs> I maybe. think that's that's my takeaway. All right, we need one hit. I just think it's funny that they also did it. Nice. Oh, okay. Let's Huge go. virus hit. Let's go. I have no horse in this race, but I hope believers lose. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Bad soup. Terrible soup. At least we got it out of there. I was scared that that was just the end. Yeah. Oh. Thank God. Thank God. Yeah. I'm gonna put that there. Just... Okay. Oh, the guardian. Yeah, that's. I, I kind of asked for that one in the position no. I was at. Oh, dang it. All right. Worm GF, you are on match point here. I can't believe Virus, uh, why MGF let Virus use his soup there, that's what I'm saying. Oh, okay. It's start. Oh my god. You like that shit? Whoa. Yeah, it's huge. Okay, I don't, I don't like that. Yeah, not a, not the biggest fan. God, sometimes you just lose yeah, sometimes you just get in like the the, the loop, huh? Yeah. Oh? oh, she's so fast, bro. She's so speedy and, and nimble. Oh, nice. Okay, we're alive. Wow. No, 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 no. Worm, she, like we just need one more point, and then it's a fresh set. Mhm. Mm no, no, it's possible. Yeah, this is still a winnable match. Incredibly winnable. No, dislike. Stop that. 
Yeah. Oh, Slime's got it. Huge. Oh, no, they don't. That's fine. That one does. Bro, Drew, Drew, fucking chill. Just fucking helping me. No, no. She wants to be dead. He's gonna try and pick up some health here. Oh, nice. Getting that one out of there. Oh. Oh, okay. That's that's not great. I can't believe Worms here would go and die like that. Yeah, Maybe I'm let's saying. go down. Yeah, because I was like, we are not overpowering three of them. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think we should have sent it down. Yep, I can't believe. Yeah, maybe we should have sent it down. Maybe if Worm GF was down, uh, that a help. All right, chat. O sevens for Worm GF. See you in two oh, weeks. Seven. Goodbye, Worm GF. There's a there's a two week time out. They weren't timed out. They were banned. Oh, it's a it's a yeah. We just. We don't need them to be banned. We just need a timeout. Listen, all I'm saying is I was in, I was goalie and I got more goals than them. So, <laughs> OMGF. Yeah. Feels bad just, for OMGF. Hey, it happens to the best of us. It happens. Use the two weeks to repent and think about what you've done. All right, chat. Show me your win. Oh, whoa. Okay. Duco B says 43 wins for Team Alpharad. Okay. I think like we're just going off of, like what sounds believable, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, they're a beta season striker? Okay. Ooh, okay. All right, sent a friend request, waiting for them to accept. Rejecting the others. Uh, all right, invited. Tyrus through, to be honest. I had more goals. What do you mean? Oh, wait, they're a goalie. Ooh. Ooh. Uh... Do you play anyone else besides Dubu? No, I've only I've played Dubu and the Fire Guy, but like I've mostly played Dubu. Gotcha. Okay. Well, uh, oh, they, I they say you just forward. assert yourself as Dubu no matter what. <laughs> yeah, they changed the forward, so I think did it change? No. Oh, wait. Dubu Frontline is funny though. Yeah, I've seen people uh play Dubu Frontline. We'll just see which one God picks to be goalie. Yeah. <laughs> Two goalies just means twice the defense. Dude. I just saw Worm GF get timed out for 1,209,600 seconds. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, 07. See you oh, in two seven. weeks. Worm GF. Worm GF, I hope next time you come into chat, I, I make it a big deal. I want to yeah. be able to, I will remember Worm GF. A, a grand, like, you know, reunion. The, the return. Okay. All right, who's, who's going to be the goalie? Maybe we shouldn't have banned their main. I, I think that's our biggest takeaway. Oh, yeah, yeah. But the, the fact is they also joined in on it, so. All right. Uh, okay, that goalie. Um, you can play forward, Dubu. I think it's funny. I'll, I'll, I'll try. I'm going to play Rune this time. Okay, they want to ban her? Sure. That's a weird character to ban, I feel. But if it's what you want to do, it's what you want to do. They also ban X base. Every team needs some brains. Okay, sure. Dubu. <laughs> Thank you, Shinji. <laughs> that is the Shinji voice actor, by the way. <laughs> That's that makes it so much funnier. And my character is Joker Persona 5 Xander Mobis Smash announcer. Oh hell yeah. Yeah, and then over here you got Junu, who's Lily Let's Pichu. Win. Rant, Rasmus, who's Sea Dog. That's Sea Dog, yeah. Yeah, and then uh, X was Aaron Hansen from Game Grumps. Mm -hmm. It's not like an all like content creator voice crew. They, I mean, those Just are like the three them. voice actors who are content creators. You know what I mean? All right, I thought we, I thought we hit that. All right, we did. Okay, Let, let's see. Let's see what we got here. Oh, ooh, uh oh. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm trying. I'm gonna slow. I'm oh, I got the ball. Oh, nice. Oh, that was almost huge. He, oh my God. Duco B. Yeah. All right, all right, Duco. Duco. I'm not sure how to pronounce your name. 
Wait, wait. I need them to do the emo. I gotta make sure they have it. Okay, okay, good, good. Make, that's how we know we didn't get just like lied to. Yeah. They're trustworthy. They have the seal of approval. All right. Yeah, that that one I'll take the fall for. Oh, weird. Ooh, ooh. So unfortunate. Yeah, I feel like I didn't really mean anything. Yeah. Uh, I didn't really do anything of value there, but that's fine. Mm -hmm. I like how as soon as the one goal goes in, everyone's like, oh my god, they're throwing. <laughs> they're throwing. <laughs> everyone's like, one goal, and they like, all hope is lost. <laughs> Oh, ooh. Thought that to do more. Oh, oh, I like it. Oh, I thought I thought I had that. Yep. Here we go. Bottom. Yeah, we, we can push this. Got it. Oh, shit. I was willing to time it. Well, let's go up. Okay. Oh, my God. Damn. Whoa. Nicely done. Bro. Yeah, having a jet. Wait, hold up. Wait, 10 gifted subs. Thank you so much. 53 away, holy shit, thank you. Oh, and there's a hype train here. Trust in Coast, I can't even like shill properly while playing this game, that's the hard part. Should I gonna get top? Did that kill? It killed someone, yeah. The, oh yeah, it's 3v2. Dude, that little dash that they have, it's kind of yeah. insane. Yeah, because they have eject button equipped, which just means, you know, they just get to uh, just yeah. go right back. I think Juno goalie with that is kind of insane, too. Mm -hmm. Pass me to you. Okay. Oh, I like the insane ang. I see the vision. Okay. I'm just going to... Oh my god, wait, he's got gifted 10 more subs, oh my god, wait, I, I'll have to look when our, okay, now that our teammate has thrown, I can properly give thanks to, uh, yeah. uh Indy 4 Johns. Wait, I need to move the <laughs> alerts over here. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh shit, we are, we are close to achieving the, yeah, the cringe so goal of the day. What's that? Huh? Uh, I said we're, we're, it's a close game, but also, yeah, we're close to cringe. Oh yeah, close to cringe. How mentally prepared do you think you are for it? Like, how do you feel when you watch uh, I've watched this? the first 15 seconds before, and I was like, it's still kind of funny. But I, oh, I am yeah, scared of, like, that. anything beyond that. Oh. Oh. That's a rough one. That's Ooh, a rough one. This is rough. It's not looking good. It's not looking <laughs> awful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm last. Movement. It was at least 3-2, you know. Yeah, do you want timeless career? Uh, I think you should take it if it falls to you. Because the, uh, the other slime girl's gonna take it. Yeah, you take yeah, it. Yeah, I got it. Um, yeah, because I would like Castle Lass or Monumentalist, but she's gonna take that. Take Monumentalist, yeah. Um, I'll just, just take this. Calm. That's fine. Yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's mobile hockey. Yeah. Hey man, so the the comebacks in this game feel better than anything else. Oh, for real. Oh, that's a nice thing. Oh my god. Oh, see, it's when it all comes together. Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> oh god. The time stopped, and you just killed a man. <laughs> Duco can single-handedly turn this around, I believe. You believe? I yeah. think so. Single-handedly, all on their own. All on their own, without help. 1v3. They're not. They're never ready for it. Oh my god, I can't believe that didn't hit. Oh, okay. Everyone gets some. Nice. Okay, now it's open. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Thank you. Oh, that felt good. Dude, yeah, getting to use like the right click, like summon the the portal, it bounced off that and you alley oop in yourself. That's like the yeah, best yeah. shit you can do with this character. That was sick as hell. 
Oh, hit that Aang perfect. They can have that. Okay, but, yeah, they can have that. It's honestly probably easier. Okay, some of them oh, are slowed. Unfortunate, unfortunate. I can't believe our teammate didn't plan around that. Yeah, they didn't plan around my, my soup? What the hell? Okay. Put that there. Oh, that was bad. Oh, they got it there. I like what they went for. Try and get the four corner angle. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate. That was wrong for them. I mean, we're still up a point, actually. I just realized. Yeah. Oh my god, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Terracotta, thank you. Oh, and over. Oh, oh is it like that? Oh, owl, owl bear? Yeah, well, it's close. Yeah, we're, we're getting there. Oh, I'm, I'm just one that hit. I guess slowed. Just a little bit. Oh, the slime was so good. There we go. Yeah. Good oh, that was. That's fine. It was all intentional. Intentional. All intentional. See? Incredible Coordinated intentional. efforts right there. All according to Kekaku. Yeah. Meteor Smash could five gift. Uh oh. Uh oh. It, it's imminent, uh -oh. man. It's, it's getting close. It is to imminent. It's cringe o'clock. It's coming. I feel like after this set might be the last we do. Yeah. Uh, I'm like... Yeah, for me it's rapid bro. fire or, Oh my god, I did. I meant to click twin drive. I was just... I did not realize I was first. I'm so sorry. Oh dear. I meant to click twi twin drive. Uh, I will take... Build different. I just didn't think I was first. Mm, I was gonna take prime time anyway, because that gives me two logs, which is nice. Yeah. It's okay. We each have a set. Where's the ball? Oh, it's done there. Okay, slowed. Nice. Oh, and Not great. their Not enemy great. Dubu blocked it off. Yeah, yeah. That's the enemy soup right there. Yeah, that, that wasn't ours. Yeah. It, it would make no sense. Yeah, why would why would our Dubu block off their, uh, their Guardian? Wouldn't make sense. Zero sense. Oh, they weren't ready for it. They were a little ready for it. Dubu forward is so weird. <laughs> yeah, he's he's not. The, it's pretty funny. It's funny. It's it's just strange. Everything I'm doing feels like it's defensive. I just look in chat. Toast says level 15 for cat ears. Now they know Toast. They know. Yeah. And we know that you know. We know yeah, you know. Yeah, you like they always appear whenever cat ears I mention. Ouch. How the fuck do you die? Rude. I guess I'm just dead. Um, oh, that was huge. There I am. We can hit this Aang. Oh. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's, that's an insane doing. angle. Um, okay, slimes. Okay. Just need to get the bottom one. Mm hmm. Oh my god, Riker BA, holy Riker. shit. Yeah, I see that. Okay, there we go. Yeah, oh, slow, just a little bit of slow. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god, that was yeah. almost such a hype shot. And then yeah. it just got stuck on the fucking wall. We protect this one of our lives. A slight miss angle. Oh my god, oh my god, shit. I'm trying to be very appreciative of what's going on in the chat right now. He appreciates the gift of subs. I, I appreciate the gift of subs, yes, yes. Thank you, everybody. I don't know who did it or the amount, but uh, just know I'm very grateful. Uh, let, let me try okay. one of these. Come on, just go in. Oh! Oh! <gasps> After all of that, what a long round. Okay, Riker. Uh, Thank you, Riker, for the 10 gifted. Anonymous for the gifted. Meter Smash rising. didn't fall for the 7 gifted. Holy shit, we're almost there. We can do this. Not today, but like maybe one day we can push it. I think this month we can do it. Are you, are you talking about 10k? Yeah, that's the dream. Yeah. I believe.
Yeah, you know, I get it. You sometimes don't expect him to hit straight into you, you know? Yeah. Oh no. Oh, oh no. One. I was very scared. Oh. oh no! I think I'll take the blame on that one, but I can't believe our teammate would let me mess that one up. I can't believe your teammate wouldn't work around. Put in the situation. Yeah, we're about to hit. Yeah, after the set, we might just have to pull, pull up the, the cringe mistakes. video. Uh, I don't oh know yeah, you, I are you at uh, 8,500? 8, yeah, five away, actually. Oh, that's huge. Uh, I like aerials, but I just don't think I'm going to get it. I'll take big fish. <laughs> oh, shit. Maybe yeah, I can so get what? it. I'll take Spark of Spring. And Riker, thank Riker. you for the the five gifted. And just <laughs> like that. I think that's 8.5. It's 8,500. That's a lot. And now, that's tomorrow, we got to push to nine. We gotta, it's oh, possible. My I think so, for sure. What were you at when you started streaming today? Like 7.7 7 or something. Oh, that's so doable. Yeah, it's, 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 it's a little insane. Uh huh. Okay, there's one. One. Uh huh. Oh, I'm gonna kill them. I want them dead. Oh, that's, oh, I thought that was in. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I'm a genius. Oh, I'm a genius. Oh, this character makes you feel so smart sometimes. Oh, oh. Oh, I, th I thought I was a genius there. Oh, that was, I thought you died because of my mistakes. No, no, no. Okay, goalie. No, no, no. We're down, but we are not out. Yes, we can do sir. this. We can absolutely do An this. All out attack. Oh, Ruby, thank you for the prime sub. Hell yeah, brother. Let's go, Ruby. Where's the ball? Where'd it go? Oh, it, it just got stuck. Oh, was it like slowed? Yeah, I hate that the ball gets slowed. Because yeah. I, I just honestly don't get the point. I like, I, I just feel like we all just sit around and go, okay. Mm. Alright, we need to get this ball out of here. Oh, God. oh, oh damn, he goodness. wanted that shit. Oh, <laughs> that's huge. You got the double at least, yeah. Alright, I'm coming back. Yeah, that was rough. I should have known. I should have known she would leap. I like mm -hmm. the play we had there, though. Mm -hmm. Okay, so she has the alt kick. We, I almost have mine. Yeah, no, Alpha Red, you're so right. For real, dude. Okay, slow, nice. Oh, that, that was almost something. Mm. Okay, watch out for the slimes. That's when it gets scary. Yeah, when. Yeah, like that. I like jokingly blame the teammates, but I was like, you cannot pass that shit to the slime and expect it to go over well. Yeah. All right, no, no, no. Match point, but we've been here before and we've lost, but I, I feel good about our chances now. Mm hmm. Slimes are so, like, hard to play around unless you, like, break them. Yeah. But I can put my roller on top of the slime so it bounces off. Okay. I feel like... Okay, I'm kind of, like, getting the download on, like, where this guy's kicking. Because he's always kicks, like, across the, the thing. Like, uh, the Kai. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh, my God. We got so saved there. Oh, dude. Stop. Oh, that's so huge. No. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh, I like what they went for. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Oh, oh, dude. All right. That's another timeout. Unfortunate. Yeah, that's an unfortunate for me. Yeah. Your points. I think we could have had it. It was definitely doable. I think it was doable, yeah. Um... I'm going to change reacting to old cringe video and then going to bed. That's that's what you mm -hmm. Wow, I'll goalie at four goals. So that's crazy. <laughs>
Yeah, no, they're honestly a little cracked. <laughs> I like what they were going for. Yeah, all right. Um, I want to do this more. I think this is a fun format, and we can definitely do it again. <laughs> no, 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 this is dope. Yeah, no, yeah we're still in secure second place. Uh, Fires, I'm going to go, but I'm going to go react to cringe video and then go to bed. Okay. Well, all right. have fun with that. Good night, brother. Let's do this as like Good a night. full stream one day. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm super down, super down. All right, all right. goodbye. Have a good all right, chat. Let's get serious now. We got some real content coming up. Dude, I am... Uh... Let's see. Um...